you. Thank you so much for joining us here. I'm in the studio right now with my lovely fiance, Amelia Rose Blair. Hello. M Amelia plays Tracy's in Detroit Become Human. Uh, perhaps we will even meet some Tracy's today. We and have. Of, and uh, not to be missed is Rog, the Rogbot. Hey, everyone. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> this is Rog. Hey, Rog, where are we real quick? Uh, we are in a studio located in Los Angeles, California, uh, where we get to test out a lot of cool streaming technology, including the graphics, where are provided by Singular Live. Ooh, so, ooh. so thank you, Singular Live. And if anybody out there is streaming on your own channel, if you want to use the graphics, you can go ahead and check out Singular Live. We also have some uh, brand new GIFs uploaded uh, for subscribers, for bits, for uh, donations. So uh, you will get to see some fresh uh, alerts popping up on the screen. Welcome aboard to everybody who is just subscribing and to everybody who subscribed before we began. Uh, you can get a free subscription if you have Amazon Prime by linking uh, your Amazon Prime account to Twitch using the link in the channel or exclamation point Prime. And these are some uh, cool commands that our mods have put into the stream. So if you type in exclamation point Amelia, you'll get the social media for Amelia. Really? You can do exclamation point ROG to get the exclamation, well, the social media for ROG, uh, as well as anybody else that we have on the stream. You can just type in their first name, uh, as well as um, upcoming events by exclamation point schedule, and uh, there are some other ones that you're gonna see floating through there. So thank you so much to our mods, specifically uh, ROGBOT, who you'll see in there as Dude288. We have not a bot with us, Blue Owls, I know is with us, I think Colorful Mess. We have a new mod named Batman, so Batman has joined us today, which is, uh, I don't know, he's the hero we, we need. We didn't know we <laughs> needed him, but thank you. Uh, thank you also to everybody in the chat for being so overwhelmingly positive, friendly. Uh, you make it really easy. Our, our mod to uh, viewer ratio is ridiculous, and we're working on getting more and more mods to help us out, but it's amazing how um, we've been able to pull it off with uh, just this little crew, because this stream is blowing up. Um, the first stream we did this, Audio level is low. Ooh. How about that? that Rog, high. maybe you can raise uh, the audio. Yeah, I, I threw you up a bit, so let's. Does that uh, help you guys? Yeah, some. Cool. Hopefully that. Let us know if that helps. Um, yeah, so we are. We have been growing so dramatically. That's all thanks to the Connor Army, and you guys are so excited. Uh, I've been getting a lot of love on um, Twitter and Instagram. Yesterday uh, went over 100,000 people on Instagram. Yeah, you which, did. <laughs> which means that more than 100,000 people started following in the last two weeks uh, on Instagram. Twitch, I'm getting uh, a lot of love. I think we we crossed over 77K. Really? 1,000 uh, followers um, when we were waiting for the stream to begin. So thank you. There are people that hang out in this chat and I try to jump in when I can, whenever we cross from 55 to 56,000 or something. And I go in there and the chat room is always full. It's become a, like a round the clock place to hang out. So if you're at work and you wanna jump in to the uh, Jericho chat or we have Crazy Angels. Uh, is that a typo? I think we're gonna switch that over to Tracy's Angels, which is what it was intended to be. I think there was an autocorrect you know, issue. The room Sometimes name, angels can go a little crazy. It's in here typed, <laughs> it's in here typed as uh, Tracy's Angels, but then it shows up as Crazy Angels. So Tracy's Crazy Angels is yeah, what it's going to have to be. I think it might be. Uh... <laughs> We're new to Twitch. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so if you guys have any pointers or things you recommend we do, we would love to oh, have. If they say um, it says Tracy. It says Tracy's now? Okay, I love cool. all the wings. You know what it is? Up. It's probably Google Translate. Maybe that's what it is. Uh, if you are on huh? Chrome, you can right-click into the chat to make it say, uh, <laughs> translate this page to, if you are in uh, an English-speaking country, English, or might be able to translate to other languages. Uh, all languages are welcome in the chat. We're super happy to have fans from around the world. Um, it's useful if you keep it in uh, English so that we can reply to you, because I only speak very little uh, other languages. Look at all these wings. <laughs> I know, it's amazing. These deviant wings. So wings we have, up. We have uh, two subscriber chats open right now, Jericho and Crazy Angels, and then we have the stream chat, which is absolutely insane. What's up to everybody who's a new follower? Thank you so much. Uh, everybody who is subscribing and donating. Thank you, everyone. Um, Quick shout out, we got uh, Adam Max, who's just donated, and wanted to thank us so much for creating a loving and welcoming community. Thank you to Adam Max, and uh, thank you to everybody else who's donated. With the help of your donations, we have been buying some more prizes that we can give away on the stream. One that we're gonna give away today, and we uh, improved these a little bit. So whoever won, I don't remember the name of who won last week, but each stream, we are going to give away uh, an autographed copy of Detroit Become Human, 
uh, and uh, the one that was supposed to be sent out to last week's winner was not sent out just yet because I've been so overwhelmed with everything else that you guys have been sending me messages on. But this has uh, been improved because we got Neil's signature, Neil Newbon and Matt Vladimiri, who play uh, Kamsky and Gavin. Uh, so Neil plays and then Matt plays Ralph and they were both on the stream yesterday doing their first playthrough of Detroit Become Human uh, they had never played the game before and they both took a, took a turn at playing the game we did a little bit of an interview talked more about performance capture so if you want to see that clip it's on the channel uh, and they also signed these copies of the game for you guys and then we have another prize which is going to be given away on our fifth stream uh, we are on stream number three of five um, we're going to be streaming on Sundays, every Sunday, uh, for the next, well, today, then two more weeks, uh, yeah. I think is going to be enough to get through this first playthrough of Detroit Become Human. But on that fifth stream, we're going to give away this, which is the, ba, 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 ba. it's beautiful, the Detroit Become Human premium edition from Japan. This was sent to us by our friends at PlayStation Japan. Um, and I've been getting adding signatures to it every time I meet up with somebody from the cast. So here we have uh, Neil Newbon and Matt Vladimiri, as well as Amelia Rose Blair, uh, who plays Tracy's. And myself, I'm going to see David and Guillaume tonight. So they will uh, sign this. We're going to go have dinner with the director and producer of this game tonight. David Cage. David Cage yeah. and Guillaume. Um, and they will sign it. Benjamin Diebling will sign it. So this is going to be uh, getting cooler and cooler throughout the streams and be our, our grand prize, so to speak. And then uh, we have a few other prizes that we're going to give away on stream today, just to shout them out real quick. So you know, every stream we try to give away some signed thank you postcards, which is me saying thank you, writing it down. Uh, we have these cool Cyberlife bands. You want to Vanna White that? Um, Cyber Life van bands, which you can put onto a notebook, is how we got them. Uh, it's kind of a cool way to. Here, it's a little tiny crown. Uh, you can put it on a bowl. Anyway, um, Amelia's gonna wear it for you. Here, this is this is how I use it. Turn your notebook into a Cyber Life notebook, uh, and then this is another prize we're gonna give away in just a second. This is a Famitsu magazine uh, from Japan. Uh, we got a 52-page spread. Of Detroit Become Human. It's really beautiful. It's basically an art book. Uh, but this will be signed by Amelia and myself as well. And um, we will send one of these off to you as well as leave a placeholder for our uh, rerun stream. We are doing uh, reruns of each of these streams so that you can watch them along live with the chat even if you live on the other side of the world. And uh, those have been going really well. So we've been, we're gonna leave a placeholder today in the stream so that we can award a winner in the future uh, <laughs> on next Saturday's stream. That's cool. And It's uh, the coolest bit of time travel that exists It's cool, anywhere. It's, time travel's it's, fun. Yeah, no. Yeah. Te technology is like super cool. Uh, and then this is our first prize for the day, um, which Amelia and I are gonna sign in a moment. Uh, but this is from the Detroit Become Human premiere event and we've been giving away some of these oh, not to cover yourself i suppose um we've been giving away these that have been signed by david and guillaume uh and the writer and so on from the premiere event but we also got these we got these signed yesterday by neil and matt uh kamsky and ralph and uh so this will be our first prize that we're going to give away um and let's see how are we going to do that we're going to do that one on Twitter, Twitter, and then we'll do another one on Twitch for the magazine. Um, but we are going to take a second at the top of this stream to introduce you to our new upcoming subscriber emotes. Uh, I've been getting a lot of um, messages from you guys and replies about how oh, people have found the, the, secret, uh, the secret bit secret cheer. Bit? Uh, we'll, t uh, we'll tell you about that in a split second. A uh, secret bit? Yes, you'll see. A secret cheer, I suppose. Okay, um, so these are some upcoming emotes, but they will be available once we become partner on Twitch. We are eligible for up to 30 emotes right now, but they are kind of locked to us until we become Twitch partners. So, Brian, yeah. why so many question marks? Why so many question marks? Because, Rog, we're going to reveal <laughs> very shortly the rest of these emotes. Um, so thank you guys for participating. While we do that, we are going to uh, do our first entry into winning this prize, the poster that Amelia has, and she's going to keep track of the winners in this handy-dandy notebook. Uh, so the way you enter to win this, and we are going to send a little message to Twitch right now, uh, because we had 3,000 people 
following for our first stream and then something like 30,000 people following by the time we did our second stream. And we're on our third stream right now and somebody check it for me exactly, but we're like 77,000 plus followers right now on uh, Twitch and we're blowing up so fast that I don't even know if Twitch knows how to handle us. So we're gonna have to send them a tweet and uh, let them know we love them. So I'm gonna post this up right now and if you wanna enter to win the first prize, just go ahead and retweet it. That is posted. It's the one that says, hey, at Twitch. Uh, go ahead and say what's up. And a special shout out, if there's anybody who's new to Twitch, if you've never used Twitch before and you're just using Twitch for the first time to join us on this stream, please comment that for uh, the message that we just posted to Twitch and say, we like having Brian Deckard and Amelia Rose Blair and the Rog Bot stream Detroit Become Human for us on Twitch. And then we will uh, check in with that at intermission to give away that prize. So you have between now and intermission for that. Nice. Um, and let's, hey Rog, let's put up some of those emotes real quick. We can maybe announce a couple. Let's go to the first. So that's our first here. card. So the first ones we've added are the press triangle, circle, X, and square, which will help us in the chat when we get feedback from you guys. Uh, as to how to play through. I'm gonna do my best as we're playing to stay focused on the game and I will read thank yous, donations and subscribers and stuff in between chapters so we don't interrupt the gameplay. Um, but if you have a, uh, an idea for an emote, you can go ahead and tweet them to me because we have a few that are not uh, decided on yet. But these are d done by Cameron K. Lewis, who's my dear friend. Uh, he was my roommate for many years. Um, he helped me survive the early years after college. Uh, and um, Cameron has done these emotes for us. You can type exclamation point Cameron into the uh, chat and that'll give you his link to his website. He has some really cool pop culture movie, super nerdy uh, stuff that you can check out on his uh, webpage, his store. Um, you know, Star Wars, Jurassic Park, all the cool stuff. A lot of Harry Potter things. Uh, I hear Childish Monsters asking where's Igby. Huh. We have something, uh, Igby can't be here right now because we're in the studio. Yeah, Igby doesn't yeah, travel yeah. so well. But mm -hmm. a lot of people were shouting out for an Igby emote. So, Rog, uh, so we have, you know, the triangle, circle, square, and X, the fish for hashtag save the fish. What kind of fish is that? Um, can we move Streamlabs to the other side real quick while we got this thing up? Yeah. Um, so that is a fish. That is Dewey the fish. Uh, we have a sumo emote. We have uh, Connor's calibration coin, and to answer the question everyone who wants to know, did I really do that? There's a clip you can find out for yourself. Somebody will post that clip, I'm sure. Um, and then we have the blue, red, yellow LEDs. And then, Rog, let's unveil some new ones, shall we? More emotes. More emotes. Sorry, a little loud, aren't I? Boom. Got a winking Connor, which was a popular request as well as an upgrade to the current Deviant emote that you see down there on the bottom, made it a little bigger and it's a little bit cooler. Uh, there's a Jericho symbol emote in the bottom corner, as well as the Cyberlife triangle. And uh, Sumo. And Sumo. And uh, somebody just used that 101 bit cheer again to get the crab dance up on the screen. Uh, for those of you that don't know, you can type 1001 if you want to cheer your bits for that code. You're gonna see a little dancing GIF, uh, some nonsense, and there's a couple other bit codes that I want to let you guys know at the top of the stream, and then they'll be secret for the rest for anybody joining late. Uh, 101 will give you a Ralph GIF. 111 will give you a Gavin GIF, I think. And a 123 is uh, Gavin when he leaves Connor hanging for a cup of coffee. So anyway, we put those in for this stream where we did with uh, Neil and Matt. If you want to check that out, we did some interviews and that's also up on the channel, as well as um, some videos of us taking the donations and going and picking up uh, these copies of the game for you guys to win. And I've been in touch with Maggie at Game Realms, uh, popular demand online. People were saying, go back to Maggie. You have to sign one for Maggie. And I can't believe we didn't do that when we were there. We were just so excited. And she was so excited that uh, we <laughs> skipped over that. So I've been in touch with Maggie. And after E3, we're going to go and uh, see Maggie and uh, probably get some more copies with the donation money that we've been receiving uh, to give away on the stream. And then uh, the one other, we got a couple announcements, if you guys will permit me before we get into this game. Um, hey, Rog, you want to show a few more new emotes? Let's toggle to the next one. Yeah. More. Ooh, I like these ones. We got the Labyrinth, RA9 etched into the wall, and I Am Alive. And those are on transparent backgrounds, so they'll show up whenever we uh, 
whatever, and I see people cheering into, uh, when you type one, two, three into the chat, that's gotta be a cheer. Just typing one, two, three is not gonna do anything. Uh, but if you cheer the amount one, two, three, uh, that's, that's when the gifts are gonna pop up. Um, but thank you for the enthusiasm. Um, and yes, very cool. RA9, save us. Um, and then there's a couple other announcements. Um, the first or the millionth, depending on when you're <laughs> joining us, uh, the, I've been getting the question a lot on social media about setting up a YouTube. Um, I, in fact, have a YouTube, but it's uh, so old that I can't log into it. And I've been <laughs> trying to re revive this YouTube uh, and uh, I've been contacting people at YouTube. If anybody from YouTube is watching right now, please get at me on email. I'm trying to get back into my account so that we can please uh, set up all these streams. Thank you to anybody that has hosted uh, clips or bits and pieces of the stream or the full stream uh, on your YouTube page. That's totally cool with me, as long as you uh, link it back to the Twitch channel and the social media stuff so they can find us uh, and watch the current streams. And um, I know there was some sadness about some old videos from my uh, like uh, end of high school days, uh, which are quite ridiculous, um, that in my attempts to get all this channel stuff back, uh, were totally deleted because I violated my own copyright, apparently. And uh, do not worry, I do have all of those videos. I am a digital hoarder, and I have all of that uh, footage that we will re-release when we officially launch our, uh, you know, our new YouTube channel. So do not worry, the crab video is not gone for forever. Um, you I know, wasn't that worried, but that's awesome. No, don't worry, wrong. <laughs> I'm sure the internet saves everything anyway. But uh, just know that a YouTube channel is coming at you and that I have done more ridiculous uh, short films and independent student films and things than I could care to admit to you and that I have a copy of all of them and I promise <laughs> I'll share them with you. We just want to make sure everything's organized and in one place uh, so that it's easy to find. So, cool. Um, but thank you especially to our subscribers that are super excited about all those, especially the Jerry and Thomas videos. Fun fact for you, Jerry and Thomas. Uh, I'm not sure who is Jerry and who's Thomas, but Cameron K. Lewis, the other gentleman in those videos with me, uh, is the guy that's been uh, doing our emotes. So I just want to make sure he is embarrassed as well. <laughs> <from his job. laughs> so you're not alone. In so it? I'm not alone. Okay. I don't know. They're a little weird. They but are. And whatever. I'm a little weird. Yeah. Um, the Connor army is nothing but compassionate and weird. <laughs> weird. Um, Yay. Cool. And then uh, we have a quick, this is E3. We're, we're apparently right now, uh, the beginning of E3, uh, I think there might even be um, events happening today. I know the PlayStation event is tomorrow. And then we will be at E3 on uh, Monday, Tuesday, we no, Tuesday, Tuesday Wednesday. Yeah, Tuesday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. 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 Nailed yes. it. And on uh, Thursday, we are doing, Rog has a card for this, the Connor Army E3 meetup. And if you guys will join us, uh, we're going to take a giant group photo of as many androids as we can get. So you don't have to be signed. You don't have to be dressed up as Connor specifically. You can be dressed up as anything. Detroit become human inspired. Uh, cosplay is super welcome. Um, I will be there. Amelia will be there. Um, uh, Rog will be there in spirit. And yeah. yeah, shout out to Rog. Exclamation point R A A G if you want bot, to get I think. Rog. Oh, is Rog it Rog Rogbot? Bot. Yeah. Uh, you can get Rog's uh, social media to follow Rogbot. And um, anyway, we're going to do a giant meetup. That's going to be inside at E3, which means you do have to have a ticket to E3 to come to that. But I think that if you're in or near Los Angeles and want to meet up, outside of the convention center that would be possible too uh and i would be down to come meet up with you guys there but the the official meetup is going to be inside i got some messages people asking do you have to have tickets to e3 to come yes uh for security reasons they're going to make you have a ticket uh it's come to the thing but the connor army meetup is totally free i'm just i mean we don't have a booth or anything i'm just going to no. be there <laughs> and dress like connor In so the <laughs> i want to see all the pictures that everyone around. who sees connor take a picture yeah oh, we're yeah. we're going to take a giant group photo too so that we have I'm sure there'll be many, many, many a photo yeah. that we will be taking. Definitely. Yes. Uh, and then this is one more announcement that's awesome. Uh, fan Art Friday. On next Friday, we're going to do a yes. fan art stream. So anybody that has been making, there's so many creative people in this community, and I just yeah. want to say thank you. Thank you for sending your uh, illustrations, drawings, paintings. Uh, people have been sending music that they've recorded, uh, songs, poems. Um cosplay photos of your cosplay uh anything you want you can submit to email deckart at gmail.com i will pull as many of those as i possibly can please include how i can tag you so if you'd prefer your instagram or your email or your website or whatever 
it's best if it's in the image, but if you include it in the, in the email too, I will uh, tag that. And we have a special prize from one of our mods that I'm gonna give away during that fan art stream. This is from Blue Owl's Medic. And Blue Owl's Medic made this, and I'm gonna sign it and send it. But I think this is really cool. It's a poster. Um, the autofocus doesn't like how shiny it is, but uh, we'll sign it and give it away. That's from a uh, shout out to our mod, Blue Owls Medic, uh, for this sending me this. Um, this has also been used by Ruby True. You can check out on her channel. She did a full body paint where she was doing cosplay as Connor per this photo and used this. So it was co cool collaboration. Um, and uh, yeah, so if you have anything to submit, please submit it by Wednesday, this coming Wednesday. Uh, because I need some time to get all of those um, submissions into uh, a stream so we can put them all up in the video. Cool. Um, then let's see if there's anything else. Oh, yeah. So one last little thing, and then we're going to play some Detroit Become Human. We're going to give away a prize and then go play Detroit Become Human. Uh, I've got a lot of recommendations from you guys on what things to play on other streams and also the question, are we going to stop streaming when we finish Detroit Become Human? No, we're not. Uh, we're going to keep streaming. This is so much fun. Yeah. Uh, I was a little terrified of Twitch in the beginning. Uh, the <laughs> first time I did a stream, uh, it was a real basic sit-up, set-up, sit-up. Uh, I was worried I would do something like doing that. Doing sit-ups, it wasn't I was doing, healthy. I was doing sit-ups on stream. <laughs> uh, but, you know, I was, I was a little intimidated by what's going to happen if you go live on the internet. Anything could happen. And uh, it turns out the thing that happened was everybody was amazing and super supportive and friendly and multiplying rapidly. Uh, I see everybody in the chat ch chanting succulent and rare parrot. <laughs> <laughs> There's some strange inside jokes, but if you hang around long enough, somebody will fill you in on, on what all this rare weirdness parrot. means. Rare, rare parrot. Maybe yes. we need to do a previous end. I'm just kidding. We're not going to do a previous on. on, but yeah. Um, well, there's <laughs> the, it would be fun. Yeah. We just need more time. If somebody could add more days in the week be between streams, we could have a lot more of that kind of stuff going on. Thank you to everybody that's subscribing, especially using your Amazon Prime. I see you can get a free yes. subscription uh, type exclamation point prime and set it up. Um, rare parrots for life, succulents for life. Uh, <laughs> you guys are ridiculous. The crab army. <laughs> We've got the crab army, the fish battalion, the rare parrots, Tracy's angels. They dubbed themselves uh, Amelia's super fans. You can see them with those, those wings in the chat. Um, very cool. I'm still fond of the Connor Hug Army, by the way. I know that. The Connor uh, Hug, Hug Army. army. We're a very lovey-dovey yeah. army. Um, we'll use our powers only for good. For love. For love. And uh, then we got to start playing this game. Yes. Um, so other people have asked me to play other games. One mm -hmm. game that we've heard a lot about, please play this game, uh, is Overwatch. So this is a unofficial announcement, but I'm going to say it anyway. Uh, Carolina Ravasa, who plays Sombra in Overwatch, uh, is a friend of mine and has agreed to come on the Twitch stream <laughs> on Saturday the 23rd, which is okay. June 23rd, Saturday. We haven't set the time exactly yet, but one or both of us will be victorious <laughs> against the other one Brian in Overwatch. But playing we're, Overwatch. That's going to blow up the internet. It's going to blow up the internet. already blown up. You just announced it. We're it's up. Yeah, we're going to do a crossover. So Connor versus Sombra. Mm -hmm. And uh, anyway, follow her at uh, Ravasa on Instagram, and we will uh, give you more info about that as soon as we can. Oh, my gosh. Who so, would win? Who would win? Probably her because she's a badass. But uh, well, you know, I dropped Norman Jaden into it. Never, uh, never mind. Spoiler. <laughs> I don't, I don't want to ruin it. But if you want to watch the heavy <laughs> rain streams, they're on there, and I don't do so hot. Um, the prize. Let's give away a magazine, shall we? Yeah, and let's then we need to it. leave a placeholder for the future, and then we'll get into it. So, Rogbot, are you ready with away. the algorithm? I am. Uh, we are going to give away this. Uh, this magazine is going to be signed. It's a uh, magazine called Famitsu which has a 52-page spread of Detroit Become Human stuff signed by myself and Amelia. Uh, we're g to enter in, all you have to do is type something into the chat. So anything kind, fundamentally decent, type it into the chat stream. Right now, all three s chats are eligible to win. The uh, subscriber chats, subscribers get five times entry into each of these prize giveaways. Uh, Amazon Prime, uh, Twitch Prime users as well. And uh, if you type something into the chat, we'll let that go for about 30 seconds. Rod, let's show a few more new emotes. You want to pop those up real yeah. quick while we let them type in? Should I write down? Yeah. That's the full card there. That's the full card, and you guys are really going to like that. Uh, my oh, favorite yeah. one is down there on the bottom oh. row is the Connor Army one, which was specifically designed so that it could be spammed all together and look like there are billions of us. 
So I like that a lot. The uh, Of course, we've got the Rebellion Fist and the blue-haired Tracy up there in the corner. That too. <gasps> what do you think of that? I didn't even notice that. <laughs> That's pretty good. Can you full screen that, Rog, or is it... Uh, uh, it's okay if not. Emotes, yeah. are, emotes are tiny little things. I think it might have been 30 seconds by now. Is that time? All right, yeah. Rog. Let's run a Rogbot algorithm and pull a winner for this magazine out of the chat. Drum roll, okay. please. Drum roll, guys. <laughs> Our winner is Magic Fox 17. Congratulations, Magic Fox 17. We will send you a whisper after the stream to get your mailing address for your magazine. Thank you very much for joining us. Now let's do one more time travel magazine giveaway. So we're going to do a drum roll in the chat, and then we're going to say, and the winner is, and then probably Ruby Truer, one of our moderators who doesn't live in Los Angeles, will give away the award. Here we go. Ready, set, drum roll in the chat. <laughs> My drum broke. <laughs> your drum broke. Oh, and the winner is, in the future, Congratulations to whoever you are. Oh, yay! We couldn't be more happy. And the chat goes wild. You're so, so lovely. Ooh, All right. Boys. Okay. Cool. Should we play some Detroit Become Human, guys? Let's play some games. Let's do it. All right, yes. I'm going to put my headphones here. Here we go. This is, uh, we're picking up Maybe we played two streams so far, so we're on stream maybe three. Well, stream three, chapter Jericho people. We just finished Jericho. We just met the people of Jericho, but they haven't said anything yet. Right. Yeah, we we I hope you're okay today. I know. All right. Sorry, Gloria, to cut you off, but nice, cool. Wow, these chats are going nuts. Everybody's saying, "What's up to Chloe?" Amelia is the best, I would say so. <laughs> <laughs> Tay Max, like, my wife. My wife. Not yet. Maybe Chloe is what he means. Or they mean. Cool, cool. They better. And we will <laughs> share, uh, there are maybe 10 or so more emotes that we have designed that I'll share with you guys at the end of this thing. Hot tip you gave me. Send me back a week's wages, baby. Come on, this is different. It's a hundred percent guaranteed. You hey, can't can the audio be a bit better? Um, game audio. Yeah. Let me know if that's better, everyone. Yeah, let us know if there's any uh, audio adjustments. Oh wait, louder or softer? I think game audio. Is game audio okay, guys? I've, I've heard loud and I've heard not loud. <laughs> Audio's fine, this evening. Okay, cool. Illegal gambling and fraud. Oh, good. Uh. Amelia will not go eat at a place that is a sea. Resisting arrest, breach of hygiene regulations. We can be louder with the Okay. <laughs> All right, I'm in. Damn straight. Hey. Don't regret this. What is your problem? Don't you ever do as you're told? Look, you don't have to follow me around like a poodle. I think our relationship got off on the wrong foot. We should forget what happened and start over. What do you say? Look, you sent me a piece of plastic for a partner, and I'm dealing with it. But if you think we're going to be buddies, you're as stupid as you look. Here you go.
Oh, thanks, Gary. I'm starving. Yeah. Don't leave that thing here. Huh, not a chance. Follows me everywhere. See? All right, chat, you want to help me out with this one? Where do we start? This Pedro, he was proposing illegal gambling. Am I right? Yeah. <laughs> and you made a bet. Yeah. And you're, you're a cop, right? I don't want to alarm you, Lieutenant. But I think your friends are engaged in illegal activities. Well, everybody does what they have to to get by. As long as they're not hurting anybody, I don't bother them. This morning, when we were chasing those deviants, why didn't you want me to cross the highway? Because you could have been killed. I, and I don't like filling out paperwork for damaged equipment. We ask about Connor, Hank, or Dickens. Yeah, Connor. Is there anything you'd like to know about me? Hell no. Well, yeah. Um, why do they make you look so goofy and give you that weird voice? <laughs> Cyberlife androids are designed to work harmoniously with humans. Both my appearance and voice were specifically designed to facilitate my integration. Well, they fucked up. <laughs> Deviants? Maybe I should tell you what we know about deviants. You read my mind. Proceed. We believe that a mutation occurs in the software of some androids, which can lead to them emulating a human emotion. In English, please. They don't really feel emotions. They just get overwhelmed by irrational instructions, which can lead to unpredictable behavior. Emotions always screw everything up. The androids aren't as different from us as we thought. <laughs> Can I ask you a personal question, Lieutenant? Why do you hate androids so much? I have my reasons. You ever dealt with deviants before? A few months back, a deviant was threatening to jump off the roof with a little girl. I managed to save her. That flashback thing was cool. Yeah. So I guess you've done all your homework, right? Know everything there is to know about me? Yeah. Yeah. Can you tell him I know? Yeah, yeah. I know you graduated top of your class. You made a name for yourself in several cases and became the youngest lieutenant in Detroit. I also know you've received several disciplinary warnings in recent years, and you spend a lot of time in bars. So what's your conclusion? I would say sincere or psychological. Let's be sincere. Yeah. I think working with an officer with personal issues is an added challenge, but adapting to human unpredictability is one of my features. <laughs> How exciting. I just got a report of a suspected deviant. It's a few blocks away. We should go have a look. should go have a look. I'll let you finish your meal. I'll be in the car if you need me. kind of want a hamburger now. <laughs> Anybody else want one? Yes. Double wink. Yeah, yeah. I also like hey, that little side glance you got. You run out of batteries or what? I'm sorry. <laughs> I was making a report to Cyberlife. Uh, I love Clancy Brown. Clancy's on Twitter now well, if you, you want to get at him. staying in the elevator? <laughs> no. I'm coming. <laughs> right, what do we know about this guy? Yeah, let's go. Not much. Just that a neighbor reported that he heard strange noises coming from this floor. Uh, Nobody's supposed to be living here, but... The neighbor said he saw a man hiding an LED under his cap. Oh, Christ, if we have to... Feathers. Nice. Investigate every time somebody hears a strange noise. 
We're gonna need more cops. Anybody home? Open up, Detroit police! Stay behind me. Got it. This is so cool for me to see it all 3D. I've seen concept art for this, but I've never... What the fuck is this? <laughs> uh. Uh. Jesus, this place stinks. Well, uh, looks like we came for nothing. Our man's go... There's something in the on, room, on the yeah. wall. birds they say <laughs> don't step on the birds i won't all right so this is ralph has done the same thing any idea what it means ra9 written 2471 times why is it obsessed with this sign looks like mazes or something Share. Mm -hmm. Its LED is in the sink. Typical deviant. Not surprised it was an android. Should we take no a human could live I mean... with all these fucking pigeons. Okay. <laughs> this is just for the people in Jericho chat right now. They're demanding it. <laughs> Blue blood. Good marks. Traces of galvanized steel. Metal hook recently broken. Bird cage. Fecal matter. What was going on here? He's just keeping all these birds. Oh. Okay, I don't. If he, if he just ran out of here right now, we gotta go. What are we doing? Wait, wait, wait. He didn't complete the... Yeah, yeah. I hate these things. <laughs> Fun fact in the original script, it was sparrows. <laughs> and I told them, I was like, nobody hates sparrows. I think he's up there. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's very 70. 
Real books. Very sad. I thought I was the last guy in Detroit to keep some. What's that? Oh, no. Exposed suspect. I mean, do we need to keep looking for clues if we know he's here? Let's go look at this poster. Yeah, we're looking for poster. Like, With that. Electronic guy. books, you can't. Urban Farms of Detroit. Urban Farm poster. Pages turning yellow. Oh, a little Shawshank. Yeah, show. No, yeah. I'm talking about this. That's nuts. Birds. Found something? Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. It looks like a notebook, but it's indecipherable. RT. RT. Probably initials. It's quality the bird's frozen. He put his initials in his jacket? That's something your mom does when you're in first grade. Your driver's license is fake. Cool. At least we didn't come for nothing. Here we go. Goddamn fucking pigeons. What are you waiting for? Chase it. Oh, God. Oh, let's go. <laughs> this is so cool. Yes, finally. Let's go fast. Ooh. Fast but risky, slow but easy. Fast. So fast. Oh, this is so sick. Fast but risky, let's go. Shout out to Josh Saul, JC, stunt guy. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. Oh! Where'd he scan, go? Scan, scan! Dig deep, the past one. Yes, please. Oh. <laughs> Holy shit! Yes. Oh my god, on top of the train. Chance of survival, 89%. Wait, you'll be so mad at you? Sorry, Hank. What up, though? Please. I've done nothing wrong. I just wanted to be free. You know what they'll do to me if you turn me in. Model eight seven four zero zero four nine six one. 
Serious malfunctions have been detected in your software, including class 4 errors. Got it. You've been deemed effective and will be sent back to Cyberlife for deactivation. Don't you fucking move. You <laughs> <Little> bastard. <laughs> You saw I was gonna fall, and you'd rather let me die than fail your yes. fucking mission! I had to make a choice. It seemed to me... What am I to you? A statistic? A zero? A one in your fucking program? Huh? Is that how you see humans, you bastard? Jesus. You had I understand you're upset. Yeah. Perhaps yeah. I didn't assess the Fuck situation. you and your fucking assessment! Come here. Sorry, Hank, but... 11% chance All you're gonna right. die, I gotta let you go. You're one of us. Shut up! Helping humans, but you're just their slave. I said, shut up! All right, come along. All right, now you save me. Hey, what the f Holy shit. Uh... Lose more suspects that way. Fucking androids. Oh man, he's mad at you now. Oh. Yeah, he's mad. Sorry, Hank. You lost the suspect. I lost the suspect, but 89% chance of survival. It's pretty high. Yeah, if if the probability Hanks is gonna live is higher than. I think you should have told him that. 60. Yeah. <clears throat> wow. That, that was so cool. That was a fun scene. I'm, I'm just going to say that, obviously, I've been watching this game with you and all this stuff, but, like, it's weird watching your friend be a badass. Dude, it's, it's, it's a little cool. strange. It's with the help of, uh, you know, 200 people at Quantic Dream that made me a lot more badass. Uh, shout out, especially, exclamation point JC in the chat. That'll get you to Jean-Charles, who did all that awesome, uh, you know, a lot of the awesome stuff. There's multiple people that worked on that, but there you go. Uh, oh. That's incredible. That's really, 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 really cool. Uh, so the um, everyone's uh, definitely talking about the decisions. People are like, "Redo it, redo it, save yeah. Hank. You're a total badass." No, I'm not redoing it, guys. This is one playthrough. We're doing this all live. I am thinking about doing, if you guys are down for it, another uh, playthrough where we go and explore all the different outcomes. And uh, I'd like to do some where we like bend the character one way or the other intentionally. Like but yeah. uh, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna stick with one playthrough because we want to see what our choices add up to. Um, I can tell you some fun facts. Uh, the wink was um, totally improv, and uh, even uh, David Cage wasn't so sure about it. But I had to convince him that it was allowed. Uh, <laughs> and people like it, so I'm really glad that you guys liked the wink. Uh, and also, because you know Connor when he goes to his mind palace is uh, you know blinking, and I thought oh, it'd be fun to do. Uh, humanize him a little bit um and now we're gonna have a winking emote uh another fun fact about this is that uh early in the animation build there were um you know they were adding all of these pigeons that would fly around the room and they move of course depending on where you are in the space sets them all into flight and the animators had fun and I, maybe they still have this if anybody at quantic dream animation is watching right now and want to post this video knock yourself out but they replaced all of the birds with Connors, so that when you walk into the room, like a bunch of Connors would fly up into the air and scatter throughout the space. Like, were like, they is tiny? That birds with faces on them? No, like the Connor model, but little tiny ones, and they're floating all around. This is just, I don't know, this is how animators uh, entertain themselves, I suppose. Okay. Got it. Um, yo, is Nate6000 correct that we have 10,000 people watching the stream right now? Uh, I was waiting. It just crossed. I was watching 10, myself. 10,000. Thank you to all 10,000 of you for joining us. This and as, as Mr. Debo pointed out, I mean, you've got a lot of competition right now in the gaming world, you know? Yo, Xbox well, let's not even mention the competition because yeah. this Connor Army is the only thing that's <laughs> happening right now. Um, so, yeah. Oh, and another fun fact is that uh, Hank punching me across the face was also improv. Me and Clancy, <laughs> yes. Me and Clancy had a lot of fun. If there's any time I got to improv in this game, it was with Clancy, and it was because we just slowly started going deviant. And David <laughs> Cage was like, no, don't do that. And we're like, we're, we're going to do it. We're going to do it. <laughs> and they took so many takes, we figured, you know, we can probably... Uh, uh, you know, get away with doing one or two just for us. But Clancy gave me a little, a little uh, wink before we did that, and I could tell he was gonna 
throw that punch at us. But David and uh, Benjamin Dibling thought I really got punched across the face when we did that take. Oh, my goodness. Should we keep going? Yes, and thank you to everyone who's subscribing with their uh, Twitch Prime and yes. the cheers and everything. Let's say thank you real quick to some donations yes. from uh, Love It First Connor has donated and said they're completely in love with the game. And, yeah, they're crabby. <laughs> you want to know why? <laughs> Um, beware Los Congrejos, uh, the, um, completely in love. Thank you. Um, how could I not help Hank? Someone has donated just to type rage in all caps. <laughs> uh, thank you. Your donation will go towards the stream and creating prizes for other people. Positivity. Your, your rage will be refueled. Uh, I'm sorry guys, but I can't. Oh, and what's up Wrath OX? Do you see, we, we just had the little party gif come up on screen. Did we? Yeah. Did we? Uh, this is a donation from Ralph OX, who is one of the people who is uh, uploading our streams to YouTube and says they now have over 1 million views on there. That's intense. He's saying, oh, as a thank you, when he reaches 100,000 subs on YouTube, they'll do a PlayStation giveaway with Detroit Become Human. That's very cool of you, Wrath OX. Nice. Thank you. And uh, I appreciate you linking back to the channel on uh, Twitch so people can find us. Um, Sharoniner has donated as well. Uh, sh shout out to the hashtag Crab Army. And um, questions about the LEDs. Um, if I find out about any kind of merch and LEDs, I will keep you guys posted, I promise you, uh, on Twitter, Instagram, and Twitch, Facebook as well. Um, thank you to everybody that is using their Amazon Prime. You can link it by typing exclamation point Prime into the chat, and you will have a free Twitch Prime account. And you can subscribe somewhere new every single month. Shall we? Yes. Get back to it. You want to play this next one? I don't know what we're going to do. Is it Marcus or Kara? Okay, okay. No pressure, there's just 10,000 people watching you. Okay, that's fine. Reacquaint myself. Who are you? Fugitives. Just like you. My name is Josh. I'm Simon. North. And... This is Jericho? It's a refuge for those who don't want to be slaves anymore. Hiding just to stay alive, that's freedom to you? Humans hate us. Hiding is the only way we can survive. There is no safe place for those like us. If humans knew we were here, they'd kill us. How many are you? There are 19 of us still in working order. The rest were damaged escaping their masters. Many tried to reach Jericho. If you succeed, Humans have little pity for our kind. I understand how you feel, but we have more freedom here than you ever did. Hmm. Humans were your masters, and now it's fear that rules you. You're no freer than you ever were. You've only found a new master. You're lost, just like the rest of us. We didn't ask for this. All we can do now is deal with it. So yeah, I believe this You're is Ben here. Lambert, who's the same guy who plays Daniel. You can stay with us as long as you want. Thank you. Go and see Lucy. She might be able to help you. Was your function before coming here? What do you care? Sorry, didn't mean to make you mad. Um... A lot of these guys are in pretty bad shape. That's how the humans treat those who disobey. They despise us. 
will never accept what we are. Well, these guys need spare parts and blue blood. Why hasn't anybody gone to get that? It's not that simple. Can't just go shopping at a cyber life store. Maybe we can. No, nobody wants to risk leaving Jericho. If you came here for comfort, you came to the wrong place. That's uh, Minka Kelly, the actor. Why not? What are you starting a fire for? Well, I don't know. It gave me the option. <laughs> I was inspired. All right. All right. People in the chat say they love you. Oh, thank you. <laughs> There's also a fair amount of love for North right now, too. Yes. Well, she's pretty badass. All right. I'm gonna talk to you. You don't look so good. I've heard humans are afraid of dying, too. Do you I... know what happens after death? No. No, I don't. Well, I'm about to find out. What's your name? Marcus. I was glad to meet you, Marcus. Oof, I just got chills. Stop starting fire. But she just died, so you light a fire, and a candle, you know. Okay. Go towards that singing. I'm trying. Ooh. Are you Lucy? Whoa. <laughs> oh, cool. Sit down. Yeah, do what you say. Yeah, yeah, anything. I've never seen this character before. Show me. Oh. I'll stop the bleeding. Feels nothing. See, she has a fire going. Drink this. Hydrate the chat. Yeah. You had it all, and you lost it all. You've seen hell, and now hell lives in you. Your heart is troubled. A part of shadow and a part of light. Which will prevail? Your choices will shape our destiny. so cool. I know. I love that. What's 
Obviously, they like the fire. Good. Okay. What's over here? child? Mm -hmm. A human? They threw him out when they didn't want him anymore. He was living yeah, he on the was... streets before we brought him here. He's breathing. They'll all shut down if we don't find a way to help them. No, he must to be help an them, we need then. blue blood and bio components. We salvage what we can from those who shut down. But there's never enough. So, how do they survive? They won't. We're slowly dying out. I smell a mission. Do you like that? Uh, <laughs> what? <laughs> a mission. I, I sense a mission coming. <coughs> All right. <laughs> Never mind. Okay, I'm gonna see what this is over here. Start this fire because people like it, and then I'm gonna go here. Hmm. Great note. Cyber Life Warehouse and Dogs West. Okay. Okay, Simon. You oh. got a plan? I do. Simon. I know where we can find spare parts. Cyber Life Warehouse is in Detroit Harbor. They have everything we need. The docks are guarded. We can't just walk in there and take what we want. Humans will never let us. Which is why we won't ask permission. We don't have any weapons. And even if we did, none of us knows how to fight. We can steal what we need without fighting. We'll just get ourselves killed. Maybe. But it's better than waiting here to be shut down. I'm with you. Maybe it's worth a try. A plan. Hatched. I like that. You saying. want to check this out a little bit? To hatch a plan. We so. didn't start the fire. <laughs> All right. Cool. All right. Hugs for Amelia. They're saying. Yeah. Bless you in the chat. Aw, thank you, my dove. People are donating and saying that we want us to be nicer to Hank. Yeah, I feel it too. Are you going to be okay? No, Toronto's not too far away to go to a meetup. We'll get Toronto. some help here. If you guys have ideas as as of we'll places where we can do other meetups in the, uh, the conventions and things, you can type them into the chat and we'll pull them out after the stream's over. No yeah. one can steal Igby, FYI. Yeah, Igby is unstealable. 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 Where are we? We're at the place. Mm -hmm. Thank you, everybody that is cheering and subscribing. I appreciate you. Let's get into this. <laughs> It'd be for president. <laughs> Nothing would happen. <laughs> I mean, at this point, I think a cat president would be just fine. There's a town in California, Idlewild, that the mayor's a dog. Really? Yeah, his name's Matt. All right, we're going in, guys. Here we go. Are you Zlatko? Who's asking? I was told you could help us. I don't know who told you that. You came to the wrong place. I'm sorry. Wait. 
We really need your help. Got a bad feeling already. Come in. And the chat is telling me to be careful. Yeah, I know. Remember to breathe, okay? Alright. Oh god. <laughs> Come on in. Yeah, please Don't be no, shy. No spoilers in the chat. Uh, if you can help it, you can help it. No, sto no spoilers in the chat, please. I've read the Connor scene, so I know about a third of the script, but I don't know anything about Kara and Mark. Luther, would you be so kind as to take these ladies' coats? Whoa. Oh, don't Thank be god. afraid of our big friend here. Luther is just another android that I helped. He keeps me company in this big, empty old house. Please, make yourselves at home. I like her shirt. Can we do a scan? She looks good with her dark hair we gave her. Yeah, she does. How did you hear about me? An android. On the street, he said you could help us. We didn't ask him, by the way. Yeah, he just, he just told, told us. us. I see. The chat is a big fan of Luther. Deviant, huh? What about her? She's human. And you want to find a safe place. Somewhere you can start a new life. I hear Canada is very lovely at this time of year. Beautiful landscapes, open spaces, clean air, and no android laws. Great place for a fresh start. Yes, that's, that's exactly what we want. Of course. Well, I can help you. But first, we have to get rid of your tracker. Tracker? Yeah. All androids are fitted with a tracking device to locate them at all times. I'll remove yours, and then you'll both be safe. I don't trust him. Come on. Follow me. Can we scan? Uh, the little one can wait for us in the living room. No, she always stays with me. Follow this guy? I guess so. Of course. All right. Right this way? Everything we need is in the basement. <laughs> oh, uh, God. No, I don't want to go to the basement with you, dude. Do we have to be here? Can we leave? Can we just leave? See ya. Thanks for everything. No, thank you. Trying to hang out. Don't want to go okay. in no basement with you. Not an option Damn. to leave this place. Really? We're kind of cornered here. L1, L1. Yeah. Uh, good job, my love. <laughs> Thanks. I just want to look at all the clues that it tells me. I'm a clue hunter. I don't like this place. <laughs> me neither. And that one. I don't like this place <laughs> let's either. Let's go. Else. I have a bad feeling. Yeah, let's. Careful. Yeah, we'll be I careful. I don't trust him either. We have to be careful. Can you scan again? Please excuse the mess. What? I need it somewhere discreet for my machines. What are we in the stables? Removing trackers is illegal, so I opted for discretion over comfort. I hope the little one isn't too scared. No. No, she'll be all right. That's good. This way, please. Okay. Mm. 
Oh God! Look, he's got like the Silence of the Lambs well in his basement. Yeah. And here, <laughs> and here we are. And we can't leave. There should be an option to shoot him in the head and leave. Ooh. You have to go into his machine. All right, the game's okay. broken, David Cage. Look, I want to leave L1. and I can't leave. If you could just stand over there. L1, L1. Here we go. You guys coming with me? Guess I'm only so. going to do this if everybody in the chat's down. Come with us. Yeah? No? I mean, down. we don't have a choice, really, right? No, okay, we'll do that. No, no one's actually down with it, but I'm excited for it. All right. It rubs the lotion on its skin. Yeah, don't say that kind of thing, my love. That's creepy. <laughs> Someone else said it. It doesn't mean you have to say it. I should warn you. <laughs> this could be quite unpleasant. <laughs> strange for some unknown reason the trackers seem to stop working in deviance that's why it's so hard to find them what? so actually there's no reason to remove your tracker what but you said that yeah uh, people believe what they want you deviants are so naive they all come to me expecting me to help them. And I just reset them. Sell Luther, them all. help us, Luther. Or I keep them for my little experiments. No! No, I, I don't want to be reset! Let me go! Ah! Oh, I forgot about the child. Um, lock it up. I'll deal with it later. Alice! Alice, no! Wow. Deviant that wants to be a mother. That's, that's so good. sweet. Fuck you, Zlatko. Yeah, yeah. I'm so deluded. Luther, can you snap this guy's neck, please? I think it's time we put you out of your misery. <laughs> God, that was loud. No, no, no. No, 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 okay, no. Okay, what do no. I do to get out of this? Hold on. Hold on? That's your solution? No, no, no. I'm trying to come up with a way. You come up with a plan and let me know what to do dream. when you figure it out. 5% it just the same way. <laughs> Tears and disorder. What can we do? What can we do? Believe me. You're better off being erased and feeling nothing. Oh, God. No more pain. Shut up. Fuck this guy. No more. Hope's I dashed. I almost envy you. <laughs> oh, poor little Alice. Oh, looks like Mommy doesn't remember you at all, huh? Looks like Mommy's completely forgotten you. Carl, <laughs> what happened to you? Oh, all right, that's enough. Come on. No. Brit man. I'm gonna teach Damn. you some man. Really stuck in this bitch. thing? Meet me in the living room. Uh. <sighs> yeah. Okay, yeah. Good that's idea. Good. Yeah. Up, up, up. 
other one saying up, up, up. Green cable or yellow cable? Green cable. Okay. That worked. Maybe. That's so loud. Get up. Should we reset or no? I don't think so. Okay, good. Memory corruption repaired. Okay, let's go. Get out of this basement. Yeah, find Alice. Alice. What is oh, this? This is terrifying. Let's leave this place. What is it? Help us. Okay. Wait, yeah. Yeah. Should we help them? Yeah. They're gonna have to fend for themselves at this point. I'm... Well, they can't though. I just opened the door. Yeah. Okay. I'm not gonna hang around in this creepy basement anymore. No. I'm done. Luther. 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 Yes, Lockwood. I should be done here in ten minutes or so. Have a look at the little one too, like you do. What? Understood, Lockwood. I'll bring you the little one in ten minutes. Should we follow Luther? We're following Luther. Yeah. I also like his diction. I'll bring you the little one. To see. That's really cool. Oh god, to be able to release animals in captivity. What are you doing here? As the master of Arthur? Uh, uh, let's leave. Yeah. Why you be here? Uh, you just passed me through. Uh, uh, it's alright. No, yes, you must sorry. Uh, no, you stay in you the tub. Be I'll be over here. You have no business here. No, you have no Hey, Luther. Um, you want to help me out here, dude? Wake up. I... I'm sorry. About the little one. Luther. He, he's guarding her, probably, right? Yeah. Uh, 
Alice. Where are you? Gonna read a magazine right now? Not me. Shotgun? Yes, please. It's not loaded. <laughs> oh. It's not loaded. It's not loaded. Oh, fuck it. Take it anyway and intimidate him with it. I want that shotgun. Oh, man. over there. Can we take some fire? Can we burn this place down? I have to burn it back. Okay. Is Alice hiding or... No, I don't want to turn on the TV. No, no. Okay, come on. You creep a little faster, Carl. Yeah, creep faster, Carl. Zoki, we're paying attention to the chat, so please keep the spoilers to, to a minimum, guys. Follow me and don't make any noise, okay? Luther! Uh, we're out of here. L1, L1. L2, L2. Yes, Zarko. I'm finished here. Go fetch the little one. Right away, Zarko. Is there like a window we can go out or something? Hide? It's not a really good hiding spot. Maybe okay. grab some fire? Can we grab some not fire? Go. What? The little one is gone! Well, I can't have just disappeared. Set a fire? Yeah, yeah. You wanna set a fire? Yeah, yeah. What are you waiting right. for? Check and firms. Yeah, okay. tell me what to do. The chat the chat's telling me to They want you to time. run Go, and hide, hide and burn the house down. Amelia wants to burn the house down, so we're gonna burn the house down. You realize we gotta be faster. Right now. To the bedroom to the corridor to the corridor. Oh god. We do to you did this. This was your idea to set the Smoke house on fire me. while we're in it. Arsonist. Is That's what they're saying. There's a fucking fire. Yeah, there is. Luther. Okay, go, go, go. you dreams always end in tears you should have listened to me what are you doing yes sir Lothar get out of my way no not this time I said get out of my way or I'll shoot right through you <laughs> how dare you 
Damn. What are you doing? Who let you out? Get away from me. Get away from me. Obey me. I'm your master. I'm your master! I saw the little one risk her life to save you. It was like opening my eyes for the first time. Finally, I could see. I know you have no reason to trust me after what I did. You didn't really do anything bad. But I know someone who could help you across the border. I could take you there. I could protect you. You and the little one. Feels a little bit like Aladdin and Jasmine, right? All right. Thank you, Mayor. I trust you. I trust him too. I like Me Luther. Too. Luther's showing up right on time. I'm so scared. Did you just hear that growl? Yes, because too. it was the um, the bear. What happened to the bear? I want, to, I want more bear. Him. We opened oh. the cage, so I hope the bear got out before the. Uh, he yeah. did. That's what. That's what his. It was that's him. what the growl was. Yeah, it was him walking away. Nice. That was stressful. That was stressful. That was really intense. Um, but we made it. Fun fact about David Cage on set that he gave the note to make things more intense more tension, more tense all the time. Hmm. And I think it paid off. Whoa. Chat room sending a lot of hugs. Thank you for all the hugs. Thank you. We'll take a hug if we can get it. Here, can I have a hug? Yeah. We'll hug it out. Oh. Hug for the hug army. <laughs> cool. So we freed the monsters and they came to our aid. Search for the house, burn it to the ground. Wow. All right. Should we play one more chapter before we take a break? Yes. Cool. Let's do it. I close this up. Thank you to <laughs> uh, Silenced or Celiced has made a donation. Sid <laughs> has made a donation for Zlatko's new home. Mm -hmm. Thank you very much for. Nice. I'm sure he appreciates that. Uh, Colin's enjoying the streams. Thank you so much for that. Um, to Small Poots. It says, love the streams. We're so adorable. Thank you. Hey, thank you very much for joining us, and uh, we're happy to have you here with us. Um, very cool. <laughs> yeah, more people are donating for Zlatko. That's very sweet. Uh, although I kind of don't like Zlatko at yeah. all. Well, well maybe like it's for his, 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 uh, Queen Amelia? his monsters to make their new home. Maybe. Yeah. Maybe it is. Uh, Kim04 asks how to donate. I, there's a link on the uh, channel page, and I think exclamation point donate will get that for you too. But uh, all the donations go into the stream and uh, contribute to sending these prizes to you guys and getting new prizes to send to you. So I think we'll play one more chapter, and then we will uh, do a um, giveaway at intermission or after intermission oh, yeah. of, of the one. poster. Yes, of this one. So if you want to enter to join us, um, to enter to win this one here, this signed poster signed by Neil Newbon, who plays Kamsky and Gavin. Uh, also, Matt, who plays uh, Ralph, Amelia, and myself will sign it. You can retweet the most recent tweet on Twitter. Uh, it's the one at Twitch, and you can say, hey, Twitch, what's up? We want to be partners so we can unlock all these emotes. Yeah. Um, wouldn't that be nice? And thank you to everybody that is using your Amazon Prime uh, to activate a Twitch Prime account. Exclamation point Prime will give you that link, and it's free. Cool. Um, let's get to it. One more, and then we'll do the giveaway. Okay, okay. I know him. Always raining.
Can you hand me the water bottle? Hydrate. Such a cool garden. I like the weeping willow. Yeah, I want to build this garden in real life. Okay. I'm down. Hello, Amanda. Kyle, I've been expecting you. Would you mind a little walk? So this was really difficult to film. We had an umbrella. The stage was only so big. Congratulations, Connor. You managed to find that deviant. Tell me, what did you learn? Now we missed something back there. Signs on the walls? The walls of the apartment were covered with drawings of labyrinths and other symbols. Like the other deviants, it seemed obsessed with RA9. Whoa, shout out to Snow Ares, who's just what donated. Else? Hello to Germany. Thank you very Hello much for the donation. Germany. Hello. Let's check out this diary. I found its diary, but it was encrypted. It may take weeks to decipher. You came very close to capturing that deviant. It's a pity you let it self-destruct. It didn't let it, it kind of just did it on its own. So you want to explain? Yeah. I knew deviants had a tendency to self-destruct under extreme stress, but I didn't expect it to jump from the roof. I should have anticipated that. How is your relationship with the lieutenant developing? Uh, he punched Hates me in you. the face. <laughs> um, ambiguous? Yeah, yeah. It's improving. <laughs> I'm coming to know him better, and he's growing accustomed to my presence. So we shot this going back and forth in the same room. We don't have much one time. One line at a time. Deviancy yeah. continues to spread. It's only a matter of time before the media finds out about it. We need to stop this. Whatever it takes. I will solve this investigation, Amanda. I won't disappoint you. A new case just came in. Find Anderson and investigate it. Thank you, Belarus. All right. What do you think this... We have a new case, new and case? I think I know what this new case is. Um, I think we should take a quick pause right here. I think this might be a good place to take a quick pause, Rog. Yeah. Okay. Does that work for you? Yeah. Um, yeah, because I want to get into this chapter, and uh, we're going to take a quick break just so that we have everybody a chance to go get some water. I was in the chat, and people asked, requested for a pee break. So yeah. this is a pee break, um, or a go get some water break, or a do whatever you like break. But we'll be back in four minutes and 13 seconds to announce the winner of this uh, prize. So if you haven't retweeted and you want to enter to win, retweet right now the pinned tweet for, or it's not pinned, but it's for tweet, it. Let's uh, get partnered. tweet at Twitch. And tweet uh, we Twitch. will be back. Thank you to everybody who's subscribing and donating. Uh, we'll be back in four minutes and 13 seconds. We've got a cool behind the scenes video from Detroit that I want to share with you. Rog? Initially, I come in here and I feel like I have I can put lights everywhere and it's going to be great. And then I realize quickly that all these overlapping lights are making it not possible to play the game at the right speed, and it's a problem. So I have to rethink my strategy. Video games, lighting isn't used the same way as we do. When you work on films, you trust your eye. You work with light as uh, something you can feel. It's like uh, paint to a painter. 
um, you get to the video game world and you have to question everything because light doesn't behave the way it's supposed to. You can basically put lights in thin air, they're invisible. Um, and that's great, the problem is lights are super expensive, they cost time. So we have to be extremely careful about where we put lights, how many lights cross, because the minute you have a single pixel that's lit by one light, they have to calculate it once, and it's shadows. You put two lights on it, the same pixel now has to be calculated twice, and same with the shadows. So a lot of what I had to do initially when I came in was trying to figure out what tricks I did on set, why I did them, and how to obtain the same result in this world. It's similar in some ways to a film, but it's also very, very different. Uh, it's similar because there is a story, there are characters, there are dialogues, um, and, and there are cameras. But it's very different because it's fully interactive, and it totally changes uh, what the experience is about, because it's not an experience that you watch, it's an experience that you play, where you make choices, where, where you tell your own story through the uh, decisions you make and through gameplay. In, in a TV writing room, you'll often put a character in a dilemma, and then as TV writers, you'll sit around and debate what would the character do. And maybe half the room thinks he'd be brave and half the room thinks it's too soon, he wouldn't be brave yet. But in the end, you make a decision and you show the decision to the audience. What's exciting about interactive stuff is that the player, the audience, is in the room with you and can make their own decision about what that character does. The steepest challenge was also the steepest opportunity in that sense. And that was something very important for us when we designed the game. We didn't want to create a game that you would watch and we didn't want the story to be told through cutscenes. We wanted the story to be told through your actions. Uh, and that was really one of the pillars that we gave ourselves at the, at the beginning of the, of the design. So I come from a TV background and in television you write linear stories. So you write along, you have, you have an axis of time and you have an axis of the character's arc. And maybe in act one the character's doing well and maybe in act two they're in trouble. As soon as you add choice to a story, the story now exists in three dimensions because this dimension of choice allows the player to divert the story in many more directions. I think f the film industry and the game industry definitely get inspiration one from the other. Um, probably games started copying or being inspired by films initially. But now I can also, also see the other, the other side and, and, and see now films getting sometimes inspiration from games in the way they film or in the way they tell stories somehow. There's still a huge distance between the two mediums of course and it's a huge challenge for us in games to tell better stories, especially when you see the quality that we, see, we know in film. Hey guys, welcome back. Thank you very much for joining us. Um, I think that we should be good on uh, getting back into the stream. Give a second for anybody to return and we will announce a winner off of Twitter. And while we're at it, um, Amelia just retweeted something that uh, was sent to us by some fans in the Connor Army uh, as a wedding gift, uh, which we think is really incredible. Um, they posted a link to take donations for Oceana, which is a charity that supports, of course, marine life. So hashtag save the fish, save the oceans, save the fish, save the everything you can. Save the straws. One thing I'm trying to do on the stream is to minimize, if we're gonna have so many people joining us, uh, I'm gonna try to use this platform for good. And one little thing that you can do to help make the world a better place is to not use a straw because plastic straws are around for forever and our oceans are filling up with plastic. And even though we're all hanging out on Twitch, uh, we need water to, you know, survive as a species. So let's take care of our planet. Metal straws. You can get a metal straw or you can get a water, yeah, bottle. water bottle. Having a reusable water bottle is a good mm -hmm. way to save uh, on plastic because a one-time water bottle is, you know, often... Uh, left half empty and, and thrown away. So I'm going to retweet this now. Um, it's in celebration, that one. Um, if you guys want to retweet it, uh, if everybody that is watching right now donated a penny, we would raise a ton of money. So please uh, consider donating even a small amount. Or if you can't, retweet it. Or if you can, retweet it. Um, but I just posted that up. And now we're going to pick a winner for hey, this signed winner. poster. 
Cool. Let's get a drum roll in the chat as I load up all of these retweets. We had, in this time, 2,000 of you have retweeted at Twitch. 2,090 of you have done this. So let me open this up so that we have everybody here so that it's fair. It's going to take me a second to go all the way to the bottom. Good luck to everybody. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Any special announcements we want to make? Rog, you want to shout out to... I, it's going to take me a second to get all these to open. Oh. Yeah, Where no, are we, Rog? We're at the Singular Live studio, and they can check out the Singular Live graphic passage, packages for themselves. Yeah, no, totally. Um, I'm just putting that up on the screen right now, so make sure to check that out if you're interested in streaming graphics and trying to do a little bit more of this kind of craziness stuff. Because, again, I'm Rog, and I'm helping... Brian, get through this, and uh, we're going <laughs> to head back Brian over to Brian. Uh, cool. Over here. And I think we got it. Uh, we got everybody open. So here we go. We're going to go. We're going to scroll through like this. I'm going to close my eyes so that it's totally random and stop. That's my drum roll. It's not a drum roll. That's a, that's a crazy, crazy bird. That's a rare parrot sound. And the winner is... Danielle Parsons, Danielle, uh, D-A-N-N-I-E-J-P-1297. Congratulations. 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 Thank you for joining us. You can identify yourself here on Twitch, but you won on Twitter, so I'm going to send you a message there. It's D-A-N-N-I-E-J-P-1297. And I'll send you a message right now. Let me know your address for the poster. Woot. Congrats. Cool. Exciting. Thank you so much. And then uh, let's do maybe a, a signed postcard for the time travel folks. Uh, so real quick, drum roll in the chat for a signed postcard going off to somebody in the future. Drum roll, please. Can happen very quickly. From... And the winner is somebody moderates in the future and says the winner is blank. Congratulations. Congratulations! Oh my gosh, that's fantastic. Thank you for watching the rerun. Reruns will yeah. happen every Saturday uh, after the stream, the day before the next stream comes up at 8 p.m. Tokyo time, uh, 9 p.m. in Sydney, and you can calculate from there. We should just take a guess next time. I mean, what, what's the worst that could happen? Take a guess? Yeah, uh, the winner is... <laughs> and then we feel right. Think about singing that landing. Anyways. That's not I'm, a bad idea. Yeah, no. Well, no. we got some hugs from China from donations. Thank you very much. And Dragon with Gray Eyes okay, says, thank you, thank you. Um, hey, we wish you luck on your final test for your master's degree. Shout out to everybody that's oh, yeah. finishing right. up. I've been getting a lot of messages from folks that have been uh, doing exams and fi finishing up their, their school year. So congratulations to anybody that just graduated, to anybody that's yes. taking their exams. And good uh, luck. Good luck. Uh, you don't need luck. Or Break a leg. Good, good study. Yeah. <laughs> Break a leg. Yes. Um, cool, cool. And just a real quick uh, thing that there are some secret uh, gifts you can pop up with cheering by cheering either 111, 101, or 123, as well as the super gif that will haunt me forever. No, this one doesn't haunt me. I like, I like the group. They, no, the group crab chat dance oh, like is one. uh, 1001. Um, cool. Thank you guys so much. Thank you to everybody who is. Um, uh, also, Yasin says, as a straight man, I'd like to say Brian is incredibly handsome. Hashtag <laughs> steal Brian. Thanks, no. Yasin. To all of our, to all of our listeners, no matter what, uh, thank you very much. We appreciate your compliments. Spout, uh, shout out, especially happy proud, uh, happy proud month, happy pride, pride month. Pride. To anybody who is uh, celebrating, look at all these wings in the chat. That's exciting. That's great. Um, yeah, those numbers are, uh, the, the, those numbers go in to the cheers. You got to cheer one zero one. Yeah. Just typing one zero one. Doesn't. is chaos but we're <laughs> <laughs> we're super happy for the chaos you guys are awesome are those gifts popping up i think so rog yeah. let us know yes um cool very cool and thank you to everybody who has subscribed and uh yeah, use their amazon prime right on happy pride should we show some no we'll do we'll do the final emotes at the end of the stream we have i think there are like six more emotes that we've created that i want to announce and share with you guys um but real quick i'm going to post a thing that says we are still live and uh we'll do a couple of questions yeah guys That's throw out uh, some questions and uh we'll, we'll pull some out we are still live cool we are still live. So um, posting on Twitter right now that we're still live, come join us. And if you have any questions, you can type at Brian Deckard, and then Rog will pull them into the... Look at this. There's a lot of pride right now. They're still putting as many emotes as possible. Pride, Thank you. Love. Yeah, I'll so throw them out. Love to everyone. 
Um, we're super happy to have you. Thank you, Connor Army, for growing so ridiculously strong. I think that we're very close to a new threshold as well. Rog, can you update us on that? Yeah, uh, we're very, very close to 79,000 last time. 79,000, which oh means we gosh. completely overlooked 78,000 while we were streaming. We were at 77,000 at the beginning of the stream. Really? Yeah. Damn. Um, that's nuts. Uh, still alive. Still alive. You're at 79,000. You've passed 79,000. Oh my gosh. Congratulations. Hype, 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 hype. Everybody cheering hype. in the chat. Thank you so much. Deviate. This is amazing. I saw something on uh, Twitter metrics that, or not Twitter, God, Twitch and Twitter are so I similar. Know, it's very similar. Um, Twitch metrics that we are one of the fastest growing accounts on Twitch right now. We are um, followed more than uh, anybody else in the last month. I feel like we are growing at a faster rate than Aren't you also the number I ever one expected. for streaming Detroit Become Human? Well, I mean, that should go without saying. We are the number one we streaming yeah. site, uh, streaming channel that is streaming Detroit Become Human, which would be wiped off the face of the earth if Jesse Williams decided to get on Twitch, which oh, we've yeah. invited him a couple times. So, uh, But until Jesse Williams brings the Marcus Army or Valerie Curry brings the Kara Army, I think the, the Connor Army is going to reign supreme on Twitch. Uh, Brian, you've getting a lot of questions specifically. I mean, we know we've answered this a long time ago, but just specifically how you got the role and, and maybe the, what that process might have been like a little sure. bit. Sure. Um, so I'm going to post this real quick, and then you guys can share it. Um, the re oh, Also, another quick thing. If anybody has questions for David or Guillaume, David Cage, the director, or Guillaume de Fondemayer, I just said a little, is that close yeah, enough? Yeah, he would I like, like that I if like I do that, right? Uh, he and I and David and Amelia are going to go have dinner after this. So if you have any questions for them, please type in David or Guillaume if you have a question for them. And we would be happy to forward those questions over dinner. Um, so retweet mm -hmm. and join us. Nice. This is how you build an army, guys. Yes. Just uh, slowly but surely. Not even slowly. Surely, but surely. surely. Yes, um, surely. Cool. So to answer the question about uh, this, and I'll be quick with it because there's more thorough know. answers in other uh, streams. But um, I auditioned for Detroit Become Human in 2000, the end of 2014, 2015, oh. the end of 2015. Um, and uh, thank you, Dreamer Kind, for the donation. The, um, the stream... The stream? No. The dream mm -hmm. was to do some performance capture. I was really excited about uh, performance capture in video games and in movies, uh, like what I'd seen Andy Serkis do in Planet of the Apes and Lord of the Rings and so on. And uh, I got an audition to do a voiceover, which was um, also going to need uh, performance. Uh, and so this game was under a top secret name, which was not called Detroit. It was called something else. Um, and uh, the first scene that I did and then the callback that followed when I met with David and Guillaume for the first time, uh, turns out that it was actually the Kara demo dialogue. So if you've seen the 2012 Kara demo uh, where she's waking up and she's uh, coming to consciousness, um, this was the script that they gave me to do for the initial audition. And uh, that was a really, really cool thing. Um, and then usually when you audition for something as an actor, you try your best to just kind of forget about them and let them go. Uh, and if you book them, you come back. Uh, but um, this one I just kind of couldn't forget about. And uh, almost like a year and a half later, I was gardening in the front yard and I got a phone call asking me what was I doing in March and could I go to Paris? And I said, uh, Yes, I would like to go to Paris. And uh, they said, great, come back and audition some more. So I auditioned three more times, and then I had a Skype message, uh, Skype meeting with David Cage uh, before eventually booking Connor. So this was the longest audition process I've ever done. This is also the longest project I've ever worked on. Um, I started working on it. The first thing we filmed was the hostage scene on the rooftop that you guys had played as the demo, the beginning of the game. And that is uh, that was done on March... 17th because it was my birthday yes, it, it was, was my first day i got to do performance there's something lucky about connor there's something special about this whole thing because this is totally unusual mm -hmm. uh it's unusual to like be in a video game but it's super unusual to be in a video game like this and then to get to play it on twitch with you guys is super cool um yeah anyway uh yeah so that was the first piece we filmed about two years ago well almost three years ago and uh, Gaming Lore Observer has asked uh, how long we've been together. Amelia and I met on a film set seven years ago. 
Uh, it'll be right just about yeah. seven years ago. No, it, it's seven. It's seven years. Yeah, and we yeah. Me, we we met on set playing boyfriend girlfriend in a film called Commencement, which you can check out. Yes. Um, and uh, Commencement the movie. We will finally get it. We got to talk to Steve Abrezzi, uh, our director, mm-hmm. about that and get a copy of that. It'd be a good gift to give away on the yeah. stream. Um, and uh, we've worked together a couple different times on True Blood and uh, some short films, and of course on Detroit Become Human, which I think we're going to get to today. Um, also, uh, yeah. for those of people asking about the earrings, these are little mini pine cones. So, Ooh. fun fact. Now you know. They're not pineapples. <laughs> they're not pineapples. They're I have pine a cones. fun little question from Avalon Spark. Um, yeah. Was there a marker that fell off the most during mocap filming? Uh, yeah. So, the mar- we were 86 <laughs> markers on our face, and always the corner of your mouth mm-hmm. would fall a lot because those, you know, that's the part of you that moves. Um, I mean, we're talking a lot. You guys know me. I talk a lot. Uh, the um, the eyelid ones yeah. were probably the ones that they had to fix a lot. Um, the they, ones underneath as well. Yeah, you have one on top of your eye least. and then two underneath. And they're so sensitive. They're connected to all... Well, they're not connected, but they're, they're uh, sourced by all of the uh, infrared cameras all around. And... Um, you know, if one of those markers go down, they have to stop the whole recording and, and fix it. So that was probably the, uh, you know, it's, it's, it's a labor intensive thing to record these. You know, there's no set and there's no um, makeup and hair and stuff in a traditional set. But there's a, there's a lot of uh, technical elements that are very time consuming to get just right or it can't be recorded. Um, start again? Should we get back into it, Rog, or do we have one more question? You guys can type in questions, and I'll answer a few more at the end. How about that? Can you tell I'm ready? Amelia's so <laughs> ready. Let's go in. <laughs> and a, a big thing happening. Hank. Hey, thank you, Buzz, for no the spoilers. donation. Thank you to everybody in the Connor Army. I'll say hello to Brazil. And thank you guys for uh, typing in your suggestions of where we might uh, find you. I would love to hear about conventions and uh, trade shows, meetups, places that we can come, because Amelia and I are super down to travel, and we would love to meet as many of you guys as possible. Should we get back into it? Yes. Cool. All right. Thanks, everybody. Lieutenant Anderson! Anybody home? I don't recognize this dog. Lieutenant Anderson! Here we go. Easy, sumo. I'm your friend. (laughs) See? I know your name. I'm here to save your owner. He seems very uninterested in you. Mm-hmm. Hank. Hank. Black lamb. Drunk. Gun. Oh, God. One bullet. Lieutenant. Lieutenant. Wake up. Just so you guys know, this was another little bit of improv right here <laughs> coming up. Wake up, Lieutenant. <sighs> it's me, Connor. <laughs> Get up. I'm going to sober you up for your own safety. Get up. I'll have to hey! warn you. This may be unpleasant. Leave me alone, fucking android. Get the fuck out of my house. I'm sorry, Lieutenant, but I need you. Thank you in advance for your cooperation. We get the fuck out of here! <laughs> Let's go, Hank. Sumo! 
Attack! <laughs> Good job. Attack! Fuck, I think I'm gonna be sick. Ah, uh... oh, leave me alone, you asshole. I'm not going anywhere. What the hell are you doing? <coughs> oh, no. I don't want a bath. Thank you. Sorry, Lieutenant. It's for your own good. So fans of Quantic Dream's previous games, uh, whether they thought they were being funny or, or kind, I don't know, but in the uh, Twitter streams before the game came out, uh, I was getting a lot of messages about, is there going to be an Android shower scene? Is there a shower scene in uh, <laughs> Detroit Become Human? And <laughs> this is that. Ah! Oh, turn it off! Turn it off! Ah! <laughs> what the fuck are you doing here? A homicide was reported 43 minutes ago. I couldn't find you at Jimmy's bar, so I came to see if you were at home. Jesus, I must be the only cop in the world that gets assaulted in his own house by his own fucking android. <sighs> Can't you just leave me alone? Solution? You seem to have personal issues. You should consult a professional who can help you. Beat it, you hear me? Get the hell out of here! Let's tease him. Yeah. I understand. It probably wasn't interesting anyway. A man found dead in a sex club downtown. Guess they'll have to solve the case without us. You know, probably wouldn't do me any harm to get some air. <laughs> There's some clothes in the bedroom there. I'll go get them. All right. Did you guys, like, match a real dog? Uh, I don't know. Uh, they didn't have a dog on set when I filmed. What do you want to wear? Whatever. Whatever. Mm -hmm. Alright, this is a good poll for the chat. Are we doing hippie, are we doing stripey, or are we doing streaky? Oh, <laughs> I like that they all ended. The, yeah, I like that all three of the options are pretty... Okay, we're bad. seeing some hippie and streaky are the two ones that people like the most. Hmm. Hippie. Maybe hippie or hippie or stripey. Oh, I don't know. I'm seeing a lot of streaky. Yeah, streaky. Tracy's Angels is all about streaky, Let's streaky, streaky, and hippie, we're streaky. Going, all right. We're going streaky. We're going to the Eden Club. Yeah, you got to look good. Yeah, you got a little, little fancy. All right, should we check out the... Let's explore a little bit. Can we explore? Now that we have these clothes, we gotta get it to them. Can you scan? And you gotta bring in those clothes, and then maybe you can explore after. All right. I hope I can keep exploring. Right, Lieutenant. <coughs> yeah, yeah. <sighs> Wonderful. Just uh, give me five minutes, okay? Perfect. Sure. <coughs> okay, time to explore. We'll let him take care of that. In her speech to Congress today. She demanded that all Russian troops withdraw from the Arctic region immediately. The Kremlin has yet to respond, but this is a new escalation in My, the conflict. There's, yeah. Many experts have suggested the specter of a third world war draws closer every day. Cole Anderson.
Sure, says him. Uh, sure. What were you doing with the gun? Russian roulette. Wanted to see how long I could last. Must have collapsed before I found out. You were lucky. The next shot would have killed you. People are telling you to go find the dog. Oh, he's ready. Oh. Be a good There's dog, Sumo. Sumo. I won't be long. Looking good, Hank. I like dogs. I like dogs. I, I like dogs. dogs. <laughs> we like dogs. Jinx. Okay. All right, so there's a lot we could have done instead. Uncovered, but let's get on to the Eden Club. Yeah, huh? let's go for the Eden Club. I think there might be somebody special in the Eden Club. Really? <laughs> I have a little feeling. Is that where we're going now? No, this uh, looks, this like, looks Jericho. like Jericho. Do you want to play some more? Catch us, we're dead. What do we do now? We need to find the Cyberlife warehouse. That's where they keep the spare parts and the blue blood. Follow me. Okay. She knows what to do. Where'd they go? Oh. I'm nervous. <sighs> Don't let them see us. I'm trying. What's up, Marcus? I'm trying to Oh, okay. 
Sorry, I'm a little new with... Reconstructing? Yeah. That'll do. Yeah. Yeah, I'm fine. Okay, I'm fine. Good I'm fine. job, Marcus. Thanks. <laughs> Quick, open the other crates and fill your bags. Take as much as you can. Okay. Take as much as you can. Yeah, there's spare parts. trespassing on private property. No, we're not. Your presence constitutes a level two infraction. I will notify security. No, you won't. John! God damn machine! Where is it this time? Uh, um, okay. Um. Grab an eye. Yeah. John! I need your help. John! Attack. I, I didn't think it was going to be like stabbing him now. I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm panicked. I'm sorry. Everybody is saying, stay, hold. And what did you do? You stabbed the guy. <laughs> Damn. Send things on fire. Let's finish up and get out of here. Stabbing people. Try to find some blue blood. Can you find some blue blood? Enough. Complete your mission. All right, fine. Now you're just murdering people. I didn't mean it. You did mean it. You pushed the button. Okay, I didn't. Those buttons didn't, are in completely different places on the controller. I didn't think that he was gonna stab him. You saw. They showed you a picture of a knife, and the option was attack. Okay. <laughs> Who am I marrying? <laughs> Damn. Thank you. Someone told me I'm doing great. It's okay. I accidentally shot a guy playing heavy rain. <laughs> <Sorry>. <laughs> Spoiler. <laughs> Serious guilt right now. You should. Why aren't you like us? Don't you want to be free? You could join us. That's all we can carry. Let's go. Take me with you. Okay. He's on their side. We can't trust him. No, he's Took not. Took a risk anymore. for us. We can't just leave him here. We can't bring them back with us. It's too dangerous. Um, they come with us. Yeah. I know where you can find more spare parts. Gotta be welcome. What do you mean? The trucks. They're full of bio components. 
They run on autopilot, but they can be driven manually with a key. Where is this key? Down there, in the control station. There are two human guards. We'll have to get the key without being noticed. This is suicide, Marcus. Our bags are full. We got what we came for. Let's go before they catch us. This is a truck full of spare parts. There'd be enough for all of us. We can't pass this up. And if we get killed, our people will have nothing. We can't take that chance. It's too risky. What do we do, guys? People say go get the key. Get the key, yeah. Yeah. Wait here. here. Look, if I'm not back in 10 minutes, go without me. Marcus. I'm coming with you. No, I'm going alone. You can do it. It's not worth it for both of us to risk losing our lives. People are donating for the family of the stabbed victim, Amelia. Oh, no. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm not going to kill anyone, I swear. Yeah, there's too many people here. Okay, let's go. Scan. Okay. Goddamn dog. Should be done already. Better off in here than out patrolling in that. Just don't go stab those guys. I'm not. Okay. Just checking. Thousand people watching you. I'm trying. <laughs> I can't get into that door. It doesn't want me to. Okay, I found the key. Here we go. What's that? Another window. There are guards outside. People, people are saying you didn't save Hank. <laughs> You're right. I didn't save yeah, Hank. You didn't save Hank. For now, it's the people. a blackout. Take this. Okay. I'm not gonna stab anyone with it. Short circuit. I'm not gonna stab anyone. <laughs> Don't worry, she's not gonna stab anyone with it. <laughs> Don't be afraid. Hurry! 
Get in. A truckload. We stole a whole truckload. We got bio components well for everybody. We couldn't bio have done it without Marcus. You get a bio component, and you, you get a bio, get a bio <laughs> component. And you, and you, and you. Bio components for Rockbot. Bio components for everybody. Well done. Everybody. I came to Jericho because here androids are free. Yeah, we are. Free to live in the dark, hoping that no one finds us. Free to die in silence, waiting for a change that's never gonna come. But I don't want that freedom. And I'm not gonna beg for the right to smile, or love, or stand tall. I don't know about you, but there's something inside me that knows that I am more than what they say. I am alive, and they're not gonna take that from me anymore. Our days of slavery are over. What humans don't want to hear, we will tell them. What they don't want to give, we take. We are people. We are alive. We are free. Yeah! Now let's change clothes, because <laughs> we all look like androids. Need like some black paint or something. Oh no! Wait. Oh, yeah. I did that. Oh wait! Oh no! I did that. Yeah. <laughs> out! Jer out! Damn Jer spot! Yeah, Jericho's out, hero. Out. Nicely done. Okay. Hmm. So that had some violent turns. I know. Yeah, these violent <laughs> delights have violent ends. I like it. There's other things we could have done. A lot of different options in this scene. You could have not stabbed the guy, for instance. You could I know. have. Well, you could have saved him. You don't think it's good that they're gonna come hunting for us a little? I mean, the public opinion of androids is probably negatively affected by us murdering people. Would you agree? Yeah. You also shot Todd. We agree that Todd deserved it, but the oh, other Todd the other guy was totally just doing his job. Totally deserved it. I you didn't. Know? Yeah, you didn't hesitate on that one when, uh, with Todd. <laughs> yeah, no, no, no. no hesitation. He had it coming. He had it coming. He had it coming. Who else loves that? Who else loves that? Chicago. Shout out to yeah. our musical theater fans. Yeah, yeah. The sexiest androids. <laughs> We're at the Eden Club. I think we should uh, take a brief second here just to remind anybody who's new to join the stream. This is Amelia Rose Blair, <laughs> and she plays the Tracys in Detroit Become Human, and the Tracys are in the Eden Club. She plays multiple Tracys. Not all of them look like her, and some of them uh, look a lot like her, in fact. Uh, and then this is Rogbot. You want to say hi, Rog? Hi. <laughs> That's Rog the Rogbot. And uh, guys, I think we are. It is possible that we cross o cross over eighty thousand followers during the stream. So I'm going to post one more uh, tweet real quick while we are streaming. If you can help me, uh, let's let's cross eighty thousand while we're here. Okay. So while you're tweeting, yeah. Um, I have something a little special that I brought for today. Um, so for those of you who don't know, I uh, was in True Blood, HBO's True Blood, and um, I was in the last two seasons. I played Willa Burrell. And um, sometimes when I'm feeling ugh, like self-conscious or down on myself or the critic in my head is just exceptionally loud, I have to remind myself 
who I am, you know, and you, you, do you know what I mean? When you're, when you're feeling really, really down and you have to get yourself out of this dark hole and something that I like to do to help get myself out of this dark hole is put on a little something. So I'm going to do that for you right now. Here we go. This is just for you guys. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes, they are sharp. <laughs> Yes, they are tricky to talk in. <laughs> yes, S's are the hardest things to say. <laughs> um, but uh, yeah, so I thought I would just bring these out. Yeah, just in case anybody. For you. In case you weren't already afraid yeah, of her. Yeah, if you weren't terrified by my fiance <laughs> before, um, now you can. Be. Yeah, so. Uh, so. Thanks for sharing that. Uh huh. And these are fun little. Uh, they made them for each of the vampires, had these. And they just flip right in. Cool. Very badass. Yeah. Thank you for sharing, Amelia. She really wanted to show you guys that. So uh, thank you for checking that out. You can also uh, get Amelia's socials by doing exclamation point Amelia. You can follow her. Chat. People yeah. are saying to bite Brian for revenge. No, they're really oh, sharp. Man. No, they're too sharp. Yeah, that's, yeah. that's a real weapon there. And before anybody asks, uh, yeah, I'm terrified. <laughs> uh, I'm terrified. should be. I was on True Blood with Amelia, and I played her blood prostitute in one episode, and, um, <laughs> you know, I had that experience. And I apologize I to everyone not having a photo queued up for that. I will next time. Yeah, yeah, blood yeah. prostitute is used. Um, <laughs> we have, uh, Rob, can you throw up the new emotes real quick? The, not the newest, newest ones, but the last page of the, the new ones for anybody who's new to join, and then we'll show you guys, unveil the final uh, grouping of them that we have designed so far, and then we're still looking for submissions from you guys for subscriber emotes. But here they are, Rog. Yeah, they're up there, and uh, everyone should see them. Cool. And the Connor army is about <laughs> to... You dig that? <laughs> about to cross 80K. Oh, my oh gosh. Oh, my gosh. The first stream, we had three. 80... Three... Uh, 80,000. Oh, oh, I thought you meant just three. On Twitch. No, no, 3,000. <laughs> uh, on hashtag <laughs> Twitch. And then I'm going to post up a thing to retweet to recruit. And let's see if we can't tip this over 80 as we finish this, uh, this next chapter. Oh, my goodness. Nice. Uh, retweet to recruit. And we're doing a little bit of fan art action, art by... If you guys are posting anybody else's fan art, please tag them and give them credit for creating their stuff. Uh, it's very important, especially to artists, to get credit for their work. Yeah, such incredible art that you guys have been tagging us in. Thank you. Yeah, and a quick shout out to next Friday is Fan Art Friday. We have a uh, special gallery show we're going to do um, that is going to be any fan art that you guys have and would like to submit, you can send to email deckart at gmail.com and that will be um, next Friday, I will put as many different submissions as I can. I'm going to try to get a good ver diversity of submissions. So uh, not everybody will be able to be featured, but as many as I possibly can fit. Uh, music, poems, cosplay, art, please send it my way, and I will host and post as many as I can. And uh, that tweet is up. Go ahead and retweet it. Let's cross over 80,000, and let's play Eden Club. I'm excited, guys. May I? Yeah, okay. I, I feel like I'm not. I'll, I got to play the Connor scenes, and yeah, yeah, yeah. but you can you can let me know how to you know. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. I see people in the chat tell me that they're working on something too. So if you're working on something, you have a little time. We've got until Wednesday before we've got to get all those in. All right, nice. let's go to it. I haven't seen this scene, by the way. So. No, no, we've not seen neither one of us. Has seen this. Oh, feels like somebody's playing with a drill inside my skull. You sure this is the place? It's the address in the report. Right. Okay. Let's get going. Jesus. Hank is hostile. We gotta we gotta warm up to Hank a little bit. Yeah. Well, he wasn't doing so well. We woke him up. Sexiest androids in town. Now I know why you insisted on coming here. <laughs> oh, boy. Welcome to Eden Club. Welcome to Welcome Eden Club. To Eden Club. Mm. Oh, hey, boy. Oh, hey, 
Hey girl. <laughs> what up now? This is crazy. Oh. North? Connor! The fuck are you doing? Oh, sorry. Coming, Lieutenant. <laughs> Investigation's ongoing, sir. I can't tell you anything for the moment. Hey, Hank. Hey, Ben. <laughs> Lieutenant Anderson is plastic. Yeah. Oh, hey, what's are interesting chats throughout. We've been assigned all cases involving androids. Oh yeah. Like wasting time. There's some pervert who uh, <laughs> got more action than he could handle. <laughs> Why are you here? We'll have a look anyway. Go home, you don't Gavin. Mind. Go. Gavin was like already here. Come on, let's go. And then his pager went it's, off. Uh, it's uh, starting to stink of booze in here. Good night, Lieutenant. Signs of strangulation, death by asphyxiation, cardiac arrest. Michael Graham, dead. But how? Ooh. Die of a heart attack. He was strangled. Yeah, I saw the bruising on the neck. That didn't prove anything, though. My love. Could have been rough play. We're missing something here. Think you can read the android's memory? Wow. Whoa, whoa, hey, hey, hey! <laughs> oh, Connor, you're so disgusting. <laughs> Think I'm gonna puke again. <laughs> Sorry, Hank. Which is how I was designed. Critically damaged. Should we connect? Yeah. The only way to access its memory is to reactivate it. Think you can do it? It's badly damaged. If I can, it'll only be for a minute, maybe less. I just hope it's long enough to learn something. Wow, cool. Okay, let's be direct. Yeah. I'm going to ask you some questions. Are you able to speak? Is he... Is he dead? Yeah, definitely. Give me the facts. Murderer who murdered? Did you kill him? No. No, it wasn't me. Tell me what happened. He started... hitting me. Again. And again. I alone? begged him to stop. Were you alone in the room? Was there anyone else with you? He wanted to play with two girls. That's what he said. There was two of us. So it was the other android that strangled him. Is that it? That was very trippy. There was another android. <laughs> this happened over an hour ago. It's probably long gone. No. It couldn't go outside dressed like that unnoticed. No. It might still be here. Still here. If you could find a deviant among all the other androids in this place. Deviants aren't easily detected. Oh shit. It's gotta be some other way. Maybe an eyewitness, somebody who saw it leave in the room. I'm gonna go ask the manager a few questions about what he saw. You let me know if you think of anything. Connor, you got this. Find that blue Did you know the victim? No, I mean, he came in maybe two, three. 
three times. I mean, these guys, they don't really talk very much, you know. They come in, do their business, and then go on their way. I have never fingerprints with androids before. Uh, excuse me, Hank. No. Once, we lost a model to... Excuse me, Lieutenant. Can you come here a second? Found something? Maybe. Can you rent this, Tracy? For fuck's sake, Connor, we got better things to do. Please, Lieutenant. Just trust me. Just do it, Hank. Uh... Hmm? Hello. A 30-minute session costs $29.99. Good on my expense account. Purchase confirmed. Eden Club wishes you a pleasant experience. Delighted to meet you. Follow me. I I'll take you to that your voice room. too. Okay, now what? I know her. Okay. Blue haired Tracy Hattori. Walked towards the entrance. So she went that way. No, no, no. That's the end of it. Okay, yeah. That's all we get from her. Mm -hmm. Okay. For all the uh, crab army. It's a good sound. It saw something. What are you talking about? Saw what? The deviant leave the room. A blue haired Tracy. Club policy is to wipe the android's memory every two hours. We only have a few minutes if we want to find another witness. Okay, yeah, let's go. Okay, so right. she went. Uh, this is the entrance of the club. She yeah, walked she went out that here. Way. Okay, she walked yep. this way. Uh huh. So we're going this way, and then we gotta ask. Excuse me, miss. Let's try this one. This better be working. Tracy, I know which way it went. Then go for it. Okay. Dude droid. There are androids everywhere. Maybe. How are you gonna tell which one saw the Tracy with blue hair? Yeah, I feel like she might have. If she... I know which direction it took. I just need to find another android on its path. Damn it. This guy. Dominic played him. Okay. But that's not helping me. That's not helping you right now? Sorry. I don't care. <laughs> we gotta find her. All right, I don't think. Sorry. No, useless. I led you astray. Yeah, we can't see her here. Okay. You didn't see anything. Go back. I made a mistake somewhere. No. Oh, Connor, you gotta find her. You wanna ask the other dancing one? Yeah, let's ask the other dancer. Sir, pardon me. <laughs> Have you seen any blue hair Tracy? Whoa. <laughs> There's some crazy. So, yes, guy. they they had uh, performance capture actors, dancers doing all these. No. I lost its track again. These guys? Again, yeah, spent yeah. Spent all this money, and I'm still not having fun. Sneaking around. Turned into the blue room. I think it's her. Uh huh. All right, this way here. No, no, yeah, there. All right. She came in here, and this one's like over here. Thank you. 
this guy. Maybe that cleaning guy. Hey, don't worry, chat. I'm gonna. I'm not gonna be looking at the chat until we find this blue hair Tracy. So. Wait. No spoilers, please. I'll take it from here. Can't, can't spoil it for me. All right. She'll stab you, I swear to God, she'll stab you. No, 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 you cannot shoot her. You I cannot have to shoot, shoot her. No, no, I you have can't. to shoot her right now. No, 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 and so I put my hands around his throat, and I squeezed until he stopped moving. I didn't mean to kill him. I just wanted to stay alive, get back to the one I love. I wanted her to hold me in her arms again, make me forget about the humans, their smell of sweat, and their dirty words. Come on, let's go.
probably better this way. Trippy. Yo, that was really <laughs> trippy. It's crazy to see your wife in a video game. It's crazier to see your w w wife. Yeah, my wife oh, yeah. 20, 20 days telling you my days. wife. Guys. Uh, that was crazy cool. That was great Twitch. There's that was two awesome. of them. That was great Twitch. <laughs> that was, that's, a, that's how you Twitch. Oh. That's really cool. You look yeah. great. Your character oh, model is awesome. You. We've seen a couple pictures and stuff, but we've not seen them yeah, in action. Yeah, no, we have not. It's a little narcissistic to fall in love with yourself, I guess. Yeah. Well, it's not you. Well, one has short hair. Right. <laughs> well, they're different entities. That's really cool. That's really cool. Wow. Oh, okay, man. so I could I could have totally shot you. Yes. And this would have happened. Yeah. Could have not found you, probably, is the yeah. other options. I could lose the fight. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You could have lost the fight. We could replay it again. You could just let him kick my ass. But we gotta. We'll, we'll do other permeations in another playthrough. We're gonna commit to one playthrough. But wow, very cool. Yeah, there's two. It's crazy that there's, there's two of you. Yeah. Wouldn't mind. <laughs> wouldn't mind that. So uh, weird. <laughs> Calm yourself, Brian. Yeah. Careful. Here we go and cut the commercial. <laughs> um, yeah, that was really cool. That was really cool. The Eden Club is like not as sketchy as I mean it's sketchy but it's not that sketchy. No, it's, it's classy. It's a classy. It's, classy. it's a classier joint than I was expecting. Yeah. We, we got into some more precarious situations with heavy rain. That felt very classy. That felt yeah, 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 right. Well, and when we I, I saw some concept art for this and it looked like a nice swanky place, but this is uh, you know cool. I'm glad we found you. Would have been I a, know I was afraid. Would have been a bummer to not even find the blue hair Tracy afraid. after all. Tracy's angels are blowing up the chat right now with all these. <laughs> All these beautiful wings. Aww. Yes. We love our lesbian androids. <laughs> we love all of our androids. <laughs> yeah, you are blushing. They're calling you out right now. Oh, goodness. <laughs> kiss, kiss in the so chat. That was so weird. That Thank was you guys. very trippy to watch. <laughs> Thank you, everybody, trippy. that is cheering along. That's very cool. <laughs> Somebody donated. Brian res wrestled with two Amelias. <laughs> um, cool. Very cool. That's a lot of fun. Badass in the chat. Right on. Oh, I want to play through that again, but I, I feel know, like... I know, I kind of um, do too. Maybe we could do like a special side stream where we play other... I was just thinking other. that maybe it'd be smart to just do an episode where we, you know... Do other options on it. Um, Amelia, though, like, do you want to talk... Now that we've seen yeah, the Yeah, now that we've finally seen it, what, talk to us. What was the experience like? How did this all come about? Well, the experience... Uh, filming this was uh, a lot of fun, but also very intense. Because um, we didn't see the other version, but the other version is... Um, Oh, it was an intense day, um, but Brian was so wonderful on set, um, and he he took such incredible care of me to make sure that I was okay, to make sure that I felt like I had enough time, and um, you're just such a wonderful scene partner, so I'm Likewise, so grateful love. that I got to work with you on this. Will you marry me? Yes. <laughs> That's the only way we could break Twitch more is if we did an actual proposal on here. We're too late. Yeah, you. you we should have been on Twitch a year ago. Yeah, Aww. that's pretty much where it should. No, have this was really cool. And and you know, we uh, fun fact about this scene is that we went to um, we went to Paris together to film for my last time that I was back uh, doing this. And I had already filmed the hostage scene. I'd filmed all the stuff with uh, Hank. I was coming back to film mostly the little bits and pieces that remained and also uh, featuring all of the scenes with Amanda in the garden. Um, and uh, Amelia and I didn't know we were going to get to work together on this game no. until we were in Paris. Yeah. And so when we were there, I knew that I was going to propose to Amelia. Amelia did not know I was going to propose. <laughs> no. I had that uh, secret kind of carrying around with me, but I knew that everything was going to be awesome. And then after we finished filming and finally I would officially be done recording Detroit Become Human, uh, that... It would be a huge relief because I'd memorized so many lines. Amelia was super helpful to me. We were running lines uh, from the hotel room. I'd be in Paris, and then she'd be nine hours behind yeah. in Los Angeles. Mm -hmm. So we'd talk like I'd be waking up, and she'd be going to bed, and I would wake up at running like lines. six o'clock <laughs> in the morning before going to set for the day. People are starting to kiss her finally. Kiss. 
That's uh, enough of that. I'm not going to do like a long extended kiss because people are going to do weird stuff with it. But I love you. Uh, anyway, we <laughs> Amelia was trying to hang out on that kiss for a second, and then all of a sudden I got nervous. Yeah. Um, um, what were we talking about? We were talking about, we got distracted. Um, uh, I knew I was going to propose. Yes, I did not know I was going to get to be in the game. Right. Um, and so when we were there filming one day, David Cage came up to me and said, so we have a bit of a problem with the <laughs> scheduling, and we don't have uh, Tracy. <laughs> <laughs> and we have to film Tracy before you go back. And basically, I was thinking for a while, maybe I shouldn't say anything. And then they'll bring me back to Paris for another mm -hmm. time, uh, which would have been good. But then the whole thing was I was going to get married or propose uh, at the end of it. So I really wanted to complete working on Detroit Become Human so that then I would be free to spend time with Amelia. We were going to go travel in the south of France. And I had this whole plan to propose at Versailles. And it was very exciting. Mm -hmm. And uh, in any case... Um, it occurred to me at the last moment when they were looking for a Tracy, I said, you know, Amelia has been running the lines with me for a long time. And I think she might even have all of the Tracy lines memorized at this point because we've done it so much. And so she came in and she auditioned for David and uh, our lead writer, Adam, was there and, and Benjamin Dibling, And uh, ultimately, David offered her the part. And so then we went from thinking that I was going to finish up shooting and then we we're going to go on a trip to the south of France and then on top of it I got a surprise back which was that Amelia and I were going to get to work together on this game Yeah. and I was really cool we have some pictures we'll post them on social media if you haven't seen them already but the uh you know, we're there in this really awesome Lycra suit with the motion <laughs> capture dots, uh, the markers all over our face. Um, I did wear heels that entire yeah. time. Amelia's um, wearing heels. Yes, I was wearing heels that had these little motion capture sensors on them. So, yep. yes, they were very sexy. Yeah. And you recorded for a couple of the other Tracys, too, that I are did. there, like, yeah. in the... In the sort of in fish the, tank in things, the fish what tank are they? Thing, the yeah. vending machines. Uh -huh. um, but was, yeah, it was a lot of fun. We shot together. It was a long day. Um, it was an intense day. It was an intense day. We did the stuff yeah. where she's the broken android first, I think. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, and then one of the, actually one of the um, level designers, I think yeah. the level designer for this scene this, yeah. uh, stood, stood in with in you. Stood in for the, for the second Tracy. So I did both of them, <laughs> but while I was filming one of the Tracys, she would stand in as the second one, and then we'd switch places. Right. Um, so that was trippy. <laughs> yeah. But I was really glad to have another person there with me because it wouldn't have been the same if I was pretending that there was a fake Tracy next to me. So to have right. somebody <laughs> else, and she was so sweet. I, I was so, she was very into it. Yeah, so, yeah, yeah. And yeah. Uh, fun fact about that kind of the doubling thing, um, Dominic Gould, who plays Tom, no, not Tom, Todd, he's a fantastic actor. He's a really, really nice guy oh, in real life. He's mm -hmm. such a good actor that he can be as horrible as Todd is. Oh. But Todd Dominic Gould, in the same way, when we were doing some of this stuff for the uh, Eden Club, when Clancy wasn't there, we, of course, recorded all the performance, all the scenes with Clancy, but for walking around and opening up the vending machines, uh, that was Dominic, who is yeah. like a body double for Hank. So the way this performance capture thing works, we can... Uh, definitely uh, splice it into pieces and stuff. But I'm glad that Amelia and I got to be on set at the same yeah, time. Yeah, it was really cool. Yeah. Also, uh, Kamsky slash the actor who plays Gavin, uh, his name is Neil Newbon. He was actually there in the room when we were recording. Um, Joe Sheridan, who's the, the cop with the uh, earring that you see at uh, Carlos's spot. He's on Versailles, the TV show Versailles. And we recognized him when we were watching Versailles because yeah. we're super fans of the show. So good. Um, but anyway, yeah, getting getting engaged in Versailles after you worked on this game with me uh, was really really cool. Mm -hmm. That's the fun. That's the fun fact behind the scenes about this. You but are, I, you I think are we should stabbing the chat in the heart right now. Stabbing like the chat in the heart. <laughs> that's Amelia. I would never stab. I would. I would. I would. Oh, <laughs> Amelia, an accident. No, no, no. <laughs> Amelia would stab you in the heart, and then I would uh, check the blue blood. <laughs> Uh, Simple Gazer, thank you for the donation. Uh, resurrected, thank you so much. Um, this is cool. Thank you guys for contributing to the stream and for cheering along. I love it. Cool, cool, cool. Should we do um, one more chapter? Or what time is it? How are we doing? We should probably give away our final prize and let it roll. We want to make sure that we're respectful of everyone's oh, I'm time. I'm so glad that we finally got to that. We got to the blue-haired Tracy. Yeah. Cool. Let's give away the final grand prizes, should we? <gasps> Yeah. And do we yes. do we do it um, for the stream? People are like you. Oh, oh. oh so oh. one thing that I want to share real quick. Or here, we'll do this. Rog, do you have the video from my mom <laughs> that I sent you? In, by email? Uh, yeah, give me a minute to queue it up. Okay, so Rog's going to queue up a video. Um, how are we doing on our, how close are we to 80, 80K? Uh, let's check it out. 
Anybody can give me the, the recent update. Uh, we're close. Not, we're 79.629 or something like that. We might not make it before the end of the stream, but we'll make it right afterwards. Um, so that you guys know this. Uh, first of all, my dad is watching in the stream chat right now, so you would know him as Dad Droid. Hi, Dad uh, Droid. Dad Droid did a playthrough of the demo, and Dad Droid has been playing uh, back in Michigan and updating me with his playthrough uh, successes and failures. Let's just say he's going back at playthrough number two with a vengeance he's got some unfinished business he's trying to attend to you can watch his playthrough on the channel we did a uh, stream of my parents playing the demo my mom dad and my brother all played uh the hostage scene it had very different outcomes um so watch that if you like everyone's shouting out to dad right in the chat yes thank you so much Are you gonna give this away? uh yeah we should give that away let's give that away right now ready um somebody type it into the chat uh, we'll do this like this. Amelia has just brought my attention that the little crown, the Cyberlife band, we have not yet given away. Mm -mm. Um, so we'll do that. And then we will do another um, giveaway for the Dad signed uh, The Trip Become Human. Um, so to enter in for this Cyberlife band, type something into the chat. It's anything you want. You can say Dad Droid, you can say Mom Droid. Fun thing to do is uh, t tag somebody in the chat. Who's your favorite person in the Twitch stream? We were doing a compliment fight before. Aww. You can do it. Tag at whoever it is that you think has the coolest username. And we will do, we'll pull a winner in just like 30 seconds when Rob pulls that up. And then we'll do one last uh, winner for our, um, for our signed disc. And uh, subscribers get five times entry in to win all these prizes on the stream. Uh, if you want to subscribe for free, you can use Amazon Prime uh, by clicking the link in the channel or exclamation point prime. And we will oh, compliment fight. It's going crazy, <laughs> mom droid. All right, Rog, are you ready? Fish. The first one we're going to do is the Cyber Life Band. And the second, life, the second one we're going to do is the signed copy of the game, which is our grand prize for this stream. Okay. Rogbot running an algorithm? Yes. Cool. Thank you to everybody who's subscribing. People are jumping in at the last second to get those uh, Amazon Prime subscriptions. Thank you for doing so. Mm -hmm. Ready, Rog? And Rock? the winner is Lipa93. Lipa93! Congratulations. L-E-P-A-93. 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 We'll send you a whisper after the stream to get your mailing info to send that to you. And then uh, we will allow, let's see, one more minute. If anybody wants to up their chances of winning this uh, signed disc, or signed disc, it's a unsigned disc but a signed case of the yeah. <laughs> Detroit Become Human uh, what we did is we flipped the cover around I see some people mentioning yes it's the same case it's the US version of the game that you all recognize this is the cover but it is a reversible cover which gives you all three protagonists on the front and we thought it'd be better for signing so we're gonna um, do this on Twitch we're gonna do this on Twitch we got to give this one away on Twitch because everybody that's tuning in this is the this is the big one and then on our fit we have another one for our next stream which will be next Sunday also at whatever time you started watching us this time it's uh, Sunday 1 p.m. Pacific Standard Time and uh, there's international times posted on the channel and then this is our grand grand prize for our final uh playthrough of this which would be stream number five we're going to give away this is a premium edition from japan uh signed by neil newbon who plays kamsky and gavin matt vladimiri who plays ralph amelia rose blair who plays tracy myself we're going to go to e3 and we're going to hunt down clancy brown and we're going to get him to sign this we're taking this to david and guillaume tonight to get them to sign this uh, we're going to try to get as many people as we can. Benjamin Dibling, uh will be signing at our shooting director. So we're going to make the, uh, Adam Williams. We're going to see uh, at our wedding, in fact. So we're going to keep uh, adding signatures to this to make this is like the coolest, Most grand, awesome. grand, grandest, grand, grand, grandest prize. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. All right, cool. Um, Rog, do you have a little video? We're going to try this, yeah, yeah. Okay, so to explain this video, and Rog, you don't have to play the whole thing because I think my mom will... Uh, tell us a lot of things guys let us know if the audio it's an iphone video so we'll see but uh i made a promise early on in this and uh you all are taking me up on this promise which is if we if when we reach one million followers on twitch i will stream in a fish suit this 
is not identified anymore specifically just yet. It's still pending whether or not it's a suit with fish or a fish looking suit or a whole realistic looking fish, which is extra creepy. But we've I'd, got a team of researchers figuring it out, we have, understanding. Yeah, yeah, we got people at MIT, research. Harvard, yeah. all these NYU. We've got incredible. We got all the greatest minds working on this. Yeah. But the fish suit will happen, and my mom and dad have been watching Twitch. And uh, well, my dad has been watching Twitch while my mom plays Detroit Become Human, in mm -hmm. fact, uh, which was the most recent update I got, is that my mom was making an important decision and couldn't watch Twitch because she was trying to figure out what to do with Marcus. <laughs> but <laughs> my mom is a costumer. Uh, you will know this from the videos that I posted in my youth on the Internet. Uh, but my mom found out that I might need a fish suit, and she sent me this video. Let's see if this works. Of what she found. Can you guys I'm hear this? I'm so excited about this fish fabric. Watch what it does. It looks like it has scales. I hope you can hear and it. You can not, yeah, I'm not sure. change its colors. Can you hear it? As you brush it back and forth. <laughs> it's so very they must awesome. Be able to hear it. This is the teal purple version. And anyway, I will get all right, the you can cut it. I think moment. she she shows another. She's got another one that's kind of green too. Uh, but yeah, mm -hmm. if you couldn't hear that, uh, that's my mom. I love okay, you, mom. Cool. Uh, I love you, Dad. Love everybody. Uh, but my mom is very excited at the idea of me wearing a fish suit, and she found that fabric that looks very fishy, and she told me she's going to start by making a fish vest. <laughs> so maybe we'll wear the fish vest when we're like halfway there. Yeah, that maybe seems, at five hundred thousand, we'll put on the put on the Twitch. Fish vest, fish vest made custom by my mom. Um, but I'll let you guys know when that arrives because uh, she's pretty quick when it comes to building costumes, and I would not be surprised if we get to see that uh, sometime soon. Maybe even to E3. I could wear the fish vest no, under no. the Connor jacket. No, no. No, that's too much. No. Yeah. Uh, you have to, you have to you make the you milestones gotta, that you mm. set for yourself before the fish you're right. suit you're right. You're right. becomes a reality. The Connor army's got to work for it. Connor yeah. army become fish. Uh, <laughs> so... Oh, and also another question that I've been getting a lot of, I'm trying my best, guys, to reply as quickly as I can. Uh, my inboxes have been absolutely overwhelmed, and it's the best feeling in the world. I really wish that I could, like, just pass this on to other people in a way, and we're trying our best we can to use this all of this excitement and enthusiasm for good. Um, I'm trying my best to reply to any of the messages I can. Just a quick shout out to anybody who's writing me uh, messages and you speak another language fluently uh, and English is not your first language, you do not need to apologize for not uh, knowing English yeah. perfectly well. Mm -hmm. uh, that's one thing I've, I'm typing it over and over again, but I'll just say it on the stream so that you know it. My, I speak almost no... Uh, I have no fluency besides English. I have a few words and phrases in different languages. So please do not worry about uh, that when you write to me. And uh, the second thing I get a lot of questions of is, will I stream in the Connor suit? And uh, yeah, I will. I'll do it for the final playthrough. So when we give away the uh, Japanese premium edition on stream five, I'll do it wearing the full Connor outfit. Wow. And we'll see if we can get an outfit for somebody else. Maybe uh, we can get a, I feel like we could dress Rog up a little bit. Mm. Amelia could wear something good. Open to suggestions. You so know? yeah, we'll do a little <laughs> extra a, a little extra on the cosplay for the final uh, for the final playthrough. Cool. If anybody else wants to use this last second to use their Amazon Prime, link it up right now because we are going to draw a winner for the uh, for this final prize. No, I'm gonna, not that one. Not this one. This one. That one. That, that one's from Japan. We can't get that one away yet. No, no, that's not this fine. one. Here it comes. Um, so I'm going to let Amelia hold this. I'm going to read a couple real quick announcements, and then we will draw our final winner. And then stay tuned, because we are going to raid the Connor Army, all of you who are so epic. So epic. Uh, we're going to find a channel. Uh, Blue Owls will let us know where we're going to raid next. Rog will keep us posted. And uh, here's a few quick notes. Uh, yes, there will be a YouTube. We're making it. We have downloaded all our previous videos and we'll upload them soon. Uh, currently locked out of my uh, old YouTube account and I'm trying <laughs> to get back in. So if anyone from YouTube is watching, please send me an email. Um, help. <laughs> help us. <laughs> oh, we have new emotes to announce. Oh, so, yeah. So this is, this is exciting for everybody. Uh, so emotes are eligible to anybody who's subscribed or use their uh, Twitch Prime account to subscribe. The emotes will be uh, available as soon as we are made partner by Twitch, which shouldn't be too long i can't imagine after our mm. epic tweet that you guys just sent out um rog can you pull the pull up yep. the and end of card one first maybe okay yeah yeah let's do that so these were all the ones that have been revealed already 
So we're going to have, so that everybody can participate in the decision making, we are going to add the press triangle circle, X and square. And uh, we have a winking Connor emote, a blue haired Tracy emote, Sumo, the fish, the blue, red, and yellow LED. Deviating. The coin, Connor's calibration coin, the triangle, which is really cool. Uh, the labyrinth RA9 scratched into the walls. I am alive in blue blood. The Jericho symbol. Uh, the other one, really cool one down there is the Connor army. And uh, I just want to shout out to Cameron. I'm going to put his link in there. You can do exclamation point Cameron. Uh, he is our illustrator. He's my close friend. He'll be a groomsman at my wedding. And Cameron um, designed all of these beautiful emotes. And you can check out his link that I've posted if you want to see some of his other artwork. He's got some really cool stuff for sale on his website. Um, if you are into Harry Potter, Star Wars, Jurassic Park, Jurassic Park Lord of the Rings, uh, you know, Arrested Development, all that kind of stuff. He's uh, Very got a bunch of really cool, super custom, and you can only get them there on his website. So check that out. Um, we've got the Deviant. We've got an upgrade to the Deviant emote that you guys have all seen. Let's see some Deviant emotes in the chat real quick. Not that they need much upgrading, but I figured we'd want them all to match by the same artist. Kind of shinier. It's a little shinier. It's a little easier to read, maybe. Yeah. The Jericho um, Rebellion Fist. And then here are the new ones that no one has seen before in the entire wide world, except for maybe a couple of you. So, ooh, autofocus. Three, two, two one. one. Kick it, Rog. Boom, what do you think of that? We have a software instability up, software instability down. We might change the, where it says software to instability instead, but it's tricky with long words because they're so small in the yeah. emails. Uh, we have a mission successful and a mission failed cyber life triangle, <coughs> red and blue. Uh, the succulent fans will succulent, succulent, succulent for the Ralph emote we have up there next to the blue heart, the blue blood drippy heart. Um, yeah, Rob? Um, is that what I think it is next to the left of the, the red thing? The, the, is that? The crab? This? Yeah, next to the crab. Next to the crab is Igby. Yes. But is that? That's his hat. That's Igby's hat. That's, That's so amazing. If you're like, there's no cat in this game. Well, I like dogs and you like cats. And for the sake of uh, Twitch, we've invited Igby, our cat, to join <laughs> us. Uh, Igby has a blue hat that he wears on special occasions. Mm -hmm. um, and we put up some pictures on our, our voice chat streams of Igby wearing his hat. So that's the one Cameron used for the, uh, for the illustration. Um, there's a hydrate one, which is blue bloods. It's a little tricky to read because right now it's over blue in the background too, but that's blue blood in a glass that says hydrate. There's a special one for pride month. that says love wins, which is of course applicable to everyone, but, uh, special rainbows and, uh, made in Detroit is, this is a cool logo that they have on all of the androids, all the packaging and all the merch. Uh, has this cool made in Detroit logo. So uh, we are eligible for at present 30, but after this stream, maybe 31 or 32 different emotes uh, for all subscribers. Those will be eligible as soon as we make partner and uh, they'll be sent to you. Uh, you'll be able to start using them as soon as we uh, switch over to be partners, but they're all done. And if you have ideas for them, please tweet them at me um, because we have a few more slots that have not yet been uh, posted about. Um, cool. Let's see. Should we give away a prize? I think we should. Let's do it. Oh, re real quick, because I know there's just one more announcement because everyone's so hyped up, and this is how you get away with uh, rambling on. Uh, rerun of this will be on Saturday with a live chat, which is uh, every Saturday at 8 p.m. Tokyo time. You can watch the rerun of the previous episode the day before the next one airs. Um, we did a chill session with Neil and Matt, two of my previous castmates, uh, play Kamsky and Ralph. You can watch that on the channel as well, which is really cool. They play the game for the first time. They play the interrogation scene. And then uh, as Kara looking for a place to stay when we come across Ralph for the first, or not Ralph. Yeah, yeah Ralph, Ralph. For the first time. Um, and... Yeah. Uh, on, you got a card for this one at E3. Anybody coming to E3 this weekend? Meet me this on week. this week on June 14th at 1 p.m. Pacific Standard Time, which is E3 is in Los Angeles, so 1 p.m. in LA. Uh, you can join us dressed in your finest Android cosplay. Yes. Uh, we're going to take a gigantic group picture of everyone all together and uh, be really awesome. You do have to have tickets into E3 uh, to be in 
inside the convention center for security reasons they're not going to let you in unless you have a ticket however if there's a group of people that are in los angeles and don't have tickets to uh e3 to go inside and want to do a meetup outside please do and i will come find you or rather you can let me know where to find you uh so i want to meet up with as many people as possible and then if you have any ideas of conventions or places that you really uh would like to meet up i will tweet right now um uh convention ideas for 2018 go go you can just reply there with that and uh the connor army will assemble all right cool that's posted should we give away a prize oh, oh wait and then fridays one more thing on friday good catch rog you yeah. want to introduce it yeah, no, this is cool because I, all three of us here are artists, you know, in our own ways, and uh, we're really, really excited um, to, you know, celebrate all the amazing people who are doing fan art. And so there's going to be a cool fan art celebration on Friday, June 16th, noon Pacific time. Yep, and you can submit those to me at emaildeckart at gmail.com. Please include how you would like to be credited. So if you want me to tag your uh, Instagram, your Twitter, your Tumblr, your website, uh, if you want to include it in the image, that's extra awesome. Kind of sign it in the corner with a water stamp uh, or watermark of your um, account, or you can just include it and say, please link it to whatever, your email or your website. Uh, but the idea is to get as many different kinds of fan art as we possibly can. So if you have music, if you have poetry, if you have cosplay photos, uh, anything, please send them to us and uh, we will screen those next Friday for hashtag fan art Friday. And then uh, the one last little thing, it's not official official, but it's definitely gonna happen. We don't have a time yet, but on Saturday, the 23rd of June, which will be the day before our final playthrough of this run of Detroit Become Human, we are doing a crossover Twitch stream with Overwatch. Carolina Rovesa, who you can get her at uh, Rovesa. Let's see, I, do we type her in here? I don't know, on Instagram I'll type it in. Um, she is playing Sombra in uh, Overwatch and Instagram.com slash Rovesa. And uh, you can follow along with her. She's going to do a stream as Sombra, and I'm going to be uh, some sort of Connor Sombra thing. combo thing. And we're going to play Overwatch for the first time. I've never played Overwatch, and uh, it's going to be fun. So to answer the question, anybody that's like, are you guys going to keep streaming on Twitch after this? Yes, we're definitely going to keep streaming on Twitch after this. Thank you for everybody subscribing and following along. Um, join us for that special crossover stream. And we are going to also separately set up a charity stream. Uh, more info on that coming yes. soon. But uh, that will be something we try to do uh, hopefully in the beginning of July when we get back from our honeymoon. All right, it's time. Let's pick a winner. Pick Rogbot, a winner. are you ready with the algorithm? I am. So the way this works, emotes count if you have them or you can type into the chat, but type anything into the chat you want. I feel and like uh, Bruce Almighty. Um, anybody not ready? Okay, go. Type something into the chat. Slow mode is off. Anything you can. Subscribers, five times entry. Type in one thing and it counts. You can type in 50 things and it'll count, but it'll count as one. And we'll let that happen for 30 seconds or so. And Rog, do we have somewhere to raid after this, just to confirm? I'll double check. Uh, yes. Cool. All right. Here comes a drum roll. And the winner is Rog. Unbaked Storm. Unbaked Storm. Unbaked Storm. Congratulations, Unbaked Storm. Whatever that means. Congratulations. We are super glad that you have joined us here on Twitch. Thank you to everybody who has been retweeting, spreading the word about the Connor Army. Uh, we are doing so fantastically well on social media. It's sort of blowing my mind. Uh, I cannot believe how many of us there are. Wow, there are, oh, we're so close. Oh. We are 30, I gotta do the math in my head. We are 163 followers away from 80K. So we're definitely gonna cross over 80K today. Wow. 80,000 people the first stream we had 3,000 and it has been growing exponentially ever since so thank you guys so much for that um congratulations to our winners today we will send you a message on where to get them if you've won in the last two weeks uh hang tight things are being sent out slowly but surely as we make sure they're signed and addressed uh correctly um, we want to make sure that everything gets to everyone just fine 
And then, um, I don't know. Thanks for being awesome. Yeah. <laughs> you guys are great. <laughs> Thank yeah. you, Rogbot Singular Live, for hosting us. Thank you, Amelia Rose Blair, for finding us uh, blue-haired Tracy's. Oh, my pleasure. That was fun. That um, Cool. So we're going to keep the chat up for a little bit so you guys can say hello and goodbye. And in about uh, f maybe five or so minutes, once we oh, – we got to stay here until we cross 80K. I feel like we're going to do it. All right, so here's the idea. We'll keep, we're going to, we're going to, uh, diminish the screen so that you guys can, uh, get the announcements of what's coming up. We're going to stay in the stream chat until we get to 80 K. We'll have a huge emoji explosion and then we will raid on. And when we arrive, we are kind raiders. So we only show up with the most peaceful intentions, but, um, you know, Spam the hell out of their chat with a whole bunch, <laughs> <laughs> with, a, with a whole bunch of deviant emotes and in a nice way. any any other ones you've got. Sometimes some folks have the spam Detroit. with hugs. Spam Hunter. with hugs. Spam with lug. Tell them that the Connor Army is there, and we're ready to recruit. Because the more we add to our crew, the stronger we get. The further along we go, the more emotes we unlock, the more good we can do in the world. I'm super excited to meet a bunch of you at E3. Uh, this whole coming next week, I will be off and on of Twitch. I probably won't be able to make specific announcements about when I am live with the uh, E3 streams, but uh, stay tuned here on E3. Thank you to everybody that's hanging out and keeping the chat warm in between streams. Thank the mods. Thank the mods. Thank the mods. Especially thank the mods. Do we have a uh, special thing we can type in for the mods? It'll list everybody. It's an exclamation point. Thank you to our new mod, Batman, for joining us here. And thank you to Notabot, Blue Owls, Colorful Mess, uh, Ruby True, Cyborg Angel, uh, anybody else who I may have possibly skipped in all of this frenzy. Um, thank you to our mods. Thank you to Twitch for hosting us. Thank you to all of you for following, following along uh, on Instagram and Twitter. I will read all of your messages and reply to them uh, as, as quickly as I possibly can um, within, you know, I still have to plan a final steps of a wedding. So uh, maybe that's <laughs> yeah. what I'll do on our honeymoon. We'll just lay there and, and uh, reply to, no? <laughs> Is that, that's not what you wanted to do? We might take a social media hiatus during our honeymoon, but then we'll come back and reply to all of the things we've missed. Thank you guys so much. We super, 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 super appreciate you being here. Mr. God. Debo, you're the forgotten one. Mr. Mr. Debo. Who, by the way, Mr. Derek Bow is at uh, E3. We, yes. we met up at E3 last year, too. We did. Um, and Derek sent me a message that he has some prizes for the stream. So shout out to Derek, and uh, we will try our best, assuming we have any signal in uh, the convention center at E3, oh, yeah. to um, basically show what's up to Derek and get those prizes from him because he's got some things that he wants to donate to the stream, and uh, I really appreciate that, which is super cool. Um, do we have somewhere to raid, Rog? Pull that up, and then I feel like we got to stay on stream until we cross 80K because we're so close. We're How like close within 100. Now? Now we're at 105 people. Um, I put up a tweet if it might help. Uh, if you want to retweet it, the retweet to recruit run, recruit one. But I feel like we, we can't just like sign off this close to 80K, can we? No, let's just let's vamp. Ha let's hang out. What's up? Yeah, yeah, let's hang out. We could play the Deviants Escape together and get Connor's ass kicked. Yeah. I don't know. I, I, I don't, I don't want to risk it. I feel like we need to keep why our- don't we, Why don't we answer some questions? Yeah, let's answer a few questions. And if you have any questions for David and Guillaume, we're going to go have... Bonus stream. Uh, what's it? Bonus stream. I was just a bonus, bonus stream. stream. Yeah, encore. Yeah, just keep going, yeah. <laughs> yeah, we'll probably do a bonus encore Detroit Become Human stream uh, after we come back from getting married where we do maybe some of the extreme cases of Connor where we'll run all the way one way and run all the way another way because I want to show you guys how fantastically bending this story really is. Um, people are getting ready for the raid, I see. Um... How did it feel, this is from uh, the Tracy's Angels chat, how did it feel, Amelia, mm -hmm. knowing that you and I would have to interact with each other, let alone fight each other in the game? How did you feel about that? Awesome. <laughs> you felt awesome about yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. I mean, it's it, we're playing together, so I feel the safest when I'm playing with you because like, that's how we met. We know each other so well. Um, so it's so it's so much fun to get to play make-believe with you, even when it gets little intense in the make-believe world 
Yeah. Yeah. It's good news. Uh, we had a lot of fun doing it. I mean, it's, and it's an unusual thing to be doing performance capture. I mean, you're in this uh, suit with all these dots on your face and this strange big environment. And so yeah. you pretty much just use your imagination. Yeah. I mean, it's, that's acting boils down to pretty much that. Um, was it weird for you? No. <laughs> No, it was fun working with you. I mean, also, you know, Connor st starts to, you know, obviously we're moving into the story now where Connor's becoming less and less mechanical and, and uh, that sort of gradual change was something that I was really focused on uh, in building out all the different eventualities of this game. And uh, to answer the question uh, from Man2477, the next stream is on uh, Friday. Friday is the fan, fan art one. stream, and I'll probably be streaming off and on from E3, uh, and then we are going to do the next two playthroughs of this game on Sundays, same time, same place, so wherever you tuned in, uh, whatever time you tuned in today, is good. And talk about my lad, Clancy Brown, says Sunny Puff. Uh, Sunny Puffs, Clancy Brown is the coolest. You guys can check out Clancy on Twitter. He is... Uh, real Clancy Brown on Twitter and he's new to Twitter so send him a message I'm sure he would love that um, fun thing about Sumo they're asking so there, I did I wasn't there with an actual dog as Sumo I don't know if they if they motion captured a dog maybe they did um, but in a couple different times we had uh, da uh, David Cage would read in for the other actors uh, so if we didn't have, for instance, on the rooftop when we were doing the scene with Daniel, I did all of the hostage negotiation scene yelling at David Cage, uh, who was yelling back at me. Um, and uh, David's actually a better actor than you might suspect. Um, but, uh, only, well, it depends what you suspect. <laughs> 75 more followers. 75 more. We're getting... Really? That's no what way. just said. No way. Really? Oh, my God. Wow. Okay, cool. So we'll hang out until we cross over 80K. Um, the... Uh, I did ask David, I was like, oh, we don't have anyone here to play the dog. Like, David, would you, would you mind playing sumo? And he resisted so hard. So, um, yeah. I don't know. But that's a fun fact, I suppose. I like dogs. Cool. Thank you for, um, oh, somebody's saying to play Call of, uh, Call of Duty. Mm. Yeah, that would be a good one to play. Um, thank you, Rachel Guthrie, for the donation. I'm getting past 80K. Love to Scotland. Love from Scotland, but love back to, to Scotland, Scotland from us. Yes. We'd love to come visit you in Scotland. That's a place I've always thought would be really cool to go. Yeah. Um, let's see here. I've been to Scotland. You have? Once I went to the Edinburgh Festival, the Fringe Festival. Very cool. There must be some sort of Comic-Con convention in Scotland we could go to. Is there not? Type it into the chat. We'll check it out. People are saying play Until Dawn. Yeah, we yes. had uh, Neil Newbon was uh, an actor in Until Dawn, as well as our friend mm -hmm. Ella Lentini, who mm -hmm. you can see play the Detroit Become Human demo on the site. We have a um, demo playing party with Amelia, a couple other friends that have done uh, interactive stories and um, you know video game actors playing through the opening scene of this game. And um, we're going to do an Until Dawn stream. I think Ella would be down to do it. Yes. Um, she plays Halloween. the twins. Yeah, Ella plays um, Hannah and Beth, who are the twins. And we're thinking about maybe doing that during uh, Halloween to stay on theme. And we've heard also uh, Uncharted 4, uh, Life is Strange, um, Horizon Zero Dawn, uh, Fortnite. Play God of War. Te I personally am pretty tempted to play God of War next. But uh, we, have, we haven't come with an official decision on what we'll play next but uh super excited something that you guys good. are all hyped up about it um it'll be something good yeah journey was another one. Oh, we're within 54 wow this is amazing the connor army grows faster and faster stronger and stronger mm. and only for good what remains of edith finch is that it yes Who? i feel like that one that won a big award oh i thought year. i thought that was a person no 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 the, the game the game <laughs> Yeah, we're not so good with scary games. So when it comes to things like, um, you know, <laughs> probably not going to play Resident Evil. Our friend Caroline Bloom uh, is in, I think we can type in her. Can we do Caroline see if that'll pop up? Um, she plays in the uh, DLC Not a Hero, Resident Evil 7, yeah. uh, Biohazard. She's Veronica. She's Veronica. Mm -hmm. And uh, cool. Let's see. People are saying 80K. A oh, Witcher 3. I don't know. 
Witcher True. 3? Is that, I mean, that it, might take a while. Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, we're definitely, The Wolf Among Us, that's a good one. Ellen Noir, right, guys, we should Clancy just play Sky, Skyrim oh. for 100 hours. I think that's what we Dude, should do. One stream. Yo, we did one chill stream, though, where we streamed for seven hours straight, and it actually, time flew by really yeah, fast like we were we fun. were we were on twitch for a long time we but were rapping uh, singing yeah check I, that out i kind of want to play parroting. red dead redemption when it comes out i feel like that red would be dead fun. redemption looks it's awesome. kind of like gta but western yeah here i'll type into the chat this is logan the music and uh grasshopper the music that's in those other streams follow these guys on instagram they are oh, really man. awesome and their music is fantastic and we've been we've uh, asked them it was asking in the chat if when we break 100k would they do a concert and i told them uh i told them that you guys requested this so maybe uh when i hear crab back from them jella. The, the, <laughs> crab jella yes indeed uh i mean at the rate we're going we could be we have to plan a concert in the next like two days though uh so <laughs> we, we will i'm not going to make any firm promises on exactly when that'll happen but it will definitely do another concert stream 31 away from 80k is everybody ready oh my god this is excellent last chance to use your uh i've got the command all queued up so you got the second. command all queued up for yeah, the raid so, yeah so the second you guys want to do it let me know okay cool so i think we'll go from this we'll have a little bit of a celebration we'll leave our stream up for anybody that wants to say their hellos and adios and then uh maybe like five minutes we'll we'll kick into the raid when we raid we're going to show up with lots of emotes if you've got them and if you don't have them uh let's say hashtag connor army assemble and that way they'll know that we mean business <laughs> i don't know but we mean friendship all right let's yeah, see yeah that we mean friendship yeah connor army what should we say Con hashtag connor army yeah welcomes you maybe we can well they, we're, we're kind of showing up on their spot yeah uh connor army invites you to join yeah yeah that's it we'll do we'll do um like come that. join the but hashtag connor army your twitch uh post uh has 2100 retweets whoa and uh 1900 likes and 363 comments so i think we got twitch's attention i think that if twitch is not paying attention right now they need, they to, need get, to get they need to work they gotta work on their social media um super excited i was i gotta say just a real shout out to everybody that's been helping me especially uh not about dude 288 this frog bot here ruby true and cyborg angel all twitch users that have been super helpful to me in uh figuring out basically all everything on twitch twitch is an incredible community everybody is so supportive here and friendly and i'm just I went from being super intimidated to setting up a webcam and streaming through a game and like kind of, you know, uh, letting people into my life going behind the scenes on doing this. I was a little nervous to do it in the beginning. And after the first stream, I was just like, this is so much fun. It's overwhelmingly positive here. And I'm just really, really grateful to all of you guys for, uh, you know, for, the love. for spreading the love and for welcoming me in. And, and we are 17 people away from 80K. Oh my gosh. In three streams, Rogbot. I know. I'm shocked. If this anybody, is awesome. Amazing. If anybody knows of anybody else's Twitch stream that has grown so fast, you let me know. You gotta, <laughs> <laughs> that sounded intimidating there. It no, sounded no, no, like, no, we're going to go find them. No, no, no. I really want to know. I really want to know, and I want to meet these people. Like, this is, you guys are insane. I got a message from uh, Gamescom. Uh, they're saying if the tickets are not available for Gamescom anymore, but if we do come to reach out, maybe we can do something before or after outside the convention. Yeah. I mean, yeah. I'll keep you guys posted on travel plans. So on, mm -hmm. on uh, I'll put up all the socials here. But on, uh, you can follow on Instagram, Twitter, and Twitch, Facebook as well. And we're making a YouTube, which will be up shortly. Um, but if you follow along, I will keep you posted. We've got seven more they're telling me in the chat. Oh, my God. Kisses for 80K. <sighs> We're going to kiss Rog if we make it to 80K. Seven more. Seven Wait, more. Wait, did he say something? I no, missed that. No, I said I love you, Rog. Oh, okay. I didn't say anything. Okay. I'm not going to I'm not gonna kneel noob on you. Yeah, what did he do? I just saw a bunch of... He's a lovely gentleman. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so... We could hug. I, I feel know. like that's appropriate. So we're almost 80K. Seven more, they say. Um, so when we do this raid, guys, show up with the come join hashtag on our Connor Army and then tons and tons of emotes. Um, here we go. 80k and one. Oh, congratulations, to that one follower. Ah! Yeah. yeah. Do a little crab dance. Get a nice. 
I'm gonna get. Thank you so much, guys. That's amazing. Eighty thousand. Oh, oh my gosh. Holy crap. Let's have. <laughs> holy you guys crap. are awesome. Oh my god. Look at this. Look at these emotes. This is wow. madness. Oh my god. Oh my god. Thank you, Rog. Thank you, Rog. Thank of you, course. Chat. Thank you, Amelia. I love you. <laughs> I love you. Uh, I'm compelled to kiss you right now, but I'm I'm gonna let them have one on-camera kiss per stream. Um, okay, cool. Thank you so much to everybody who subscribed today. Uh, use your Amazon Prime to get a free subscription. Uh, follow us on Instagram, Twitter, and Twitch to stay tuned about the upcoming prizes. We have one more copy of Detroit Become Human uh, for the next stream signed by some cast, as well as this premium edition, which will be on our final fifth stream of this playthrough, uh, signed by even more than that. Uh, David and Guillaume are on uh, Twitter at... Uh, Detroit underscore PS4 if you want to tweet at them and let them know what you think. Uh, hashtag Detroit Become Human and hashtag Connor Army are the biggest, best Twitter hashtags to use. And thank you guys so much for following along. Follow Amelia. Don't forget. Follow, follow Amelia. Amelia. If yeah. you can want to check it out on here's the link. She's Amelia Rose Blair and you can find her on all these things. And here is Rog. You can check Rog. out Rog. Oh, it's Rog Bot. Exclamation point. Rog Bot. 80k amazing thank you so much wow. we will jump into the raid in about five minutes so that we have time to celebrate here on the channel and then uh we're going to jump over and invite some more people to join us all right stay tuned we'll see you next sunday thank you oh we should go do our sign off oh, ready yeah. oh yes yes my name is connor my name is tracy my name is rockbot and, and this, this is, is our, our twitch. twitch good night guys thank you good to see you